the congregation is live right now. I got on my green hat, you know what I'm saying, for St. Patrick's Day. It's still St. Patrick's Day over here. Um, What's up, my good peoples? How's the audio? How's everything going? My bad, I'm late. My bad, I'm late. I be trying to do too much. And I'm hot because I was trying to go on time. Hold on, I got to move my car for the... uh. For that damn Domino's truck that be pulling up. The Domino's people hollered at me. It was like, man, why you always park right there? The truck drivers be complaining. I'm like, nigga, it's first come, first serve, nigga. Whoever get to the spot first. You feel me? But what's up with y'all? How y'all feeling? How y'all feeling out here on this, uh, this good Sunday, St. Patrick's Day? Hold on. Let me move this car up right quick. It's a hard death. Shout out to everybody in here. Make sure that y'all, uh, we on our road to 6K. We only need, like, I don't know how many more. Hold on. I don't know how many more subscribers we need to get to 6K, but we almost right there. Let's do it this episode. Whatever it is that we need to do to get to 6K, make sure y'all. I do it. Fuck! I forgot to put live on my Instagram. Damn, Gina. I forgot to put that I was going live on my Instagram. It's all right. Play as fuck up, too. All right, I'm going to move this up right here. Boom. Let me settle down right quick. So what y'all got going? Oh, let me see if... Damn, I can't even... Hold on, y'all. I got a lot going on. What happened to the Apollo yesterday? Uh, nigga, you know what happened to the Apollo yesterday? And what's been happening to Apollo for the last? Man, you missed. Oh shit! You missed the season finale. Nigga, missed the season finale. What's up with y'all though? Hold on, let me get situated. I'm not situated. I don't like talking to y'all not being situated. Let me try to get situated. God damn. I got all type of shit going on. All right. I should be good. All right. This is what I need everybody to do. I need y'all to type where y'all from in the chat. You know what I'm saying? King said y'all was going live. We is. We will be going live. Oh, shout out to speaking to Kim. You see that right there with that say present, not perfect. I got my green hat on. Do y'all still be pinching people if they don't have on green on this day? That's a good question. Cause I know St. Patrick's Day used to have to have green on. Niggas used to always try to pin a dollar on them like that was some green. I got a dollar on me. I got a dollar. Put the little ring dollar on. I got a ring dollar on. Like that's going to do something. Niggas still get pinched. They try to wear green drawers that day. Look at my drawers. <laughs> my drawers green. Okay, well, okay. I see some people in the chat. We got uh West Covenience. What's up, Blicky? It's a her. Little Blaze from Houston. It's a her. Brandon Batista from Harlem. It's a her. I gotta try to make this a song. I am OG Murder Work for Texas. It's a her. That's weak. I gotta try to do it. That's tight. Seattle is a hard. Uh, K Watts with the roll call. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Boom. Boom. Y'all that I mean, Chicago. I'm back. Phoenix, Arizona. It's a her. CPT. I see you, Freddy 56. Ike, uh, there's Sprite, Oakland. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Preston Davis is a herd. Uh, uh, okay. Cash is a herd. Uh, uh, I'm trying to rap, but it don't rhyme, so it's a herd. Uh, uh. I see East LA. This is why I love the congregation. I see the 50s in the building. I see seven. This is why I love the congregation. We all over. We all around. Seattle. That's right. I see you, Malik. You know what I'm saying? We in the Bronx. I see you, Matt. Sydney, Australia. I see you, Kane. You know what I'm saying? Antoine in Maryland. I see you, Tuan, in Maryland. Evergreen, Alabama. I see you. Watts in the building. Dago. Call Dago. East LA. Yeah. 
Australia, Perth City. That's what I'm saying. The congregation, we all over. You know what I'm saying? Make sure y'all can y'all uh network and y'all connect because you feel me? We growing. If you part of the congregation, we all one. We all one. You know what I'm saying? We got Boston. Uh, what's that? Arizona. We got all type of shit. To come, I appreciate y'all representing where y'all from. Represent your city. Represent your clique. Represent your city. Represent your clique. That sound like some uh. Lil John said before. I don't know what song that was, but yeah. Represent your city. Represent your clique. Yeah. yeah. But yeah, what's up with y'all though, man? I'm here. You know what I'm doing. Clocking this uh, good old hours in. Trying to get rich. Trying to make a dollar out of 15 cents. You know what I'm saying? Talk that talk. Tiny, I see you. Yeah, I appreciate y'all pulling up. Hey, we did it. Big last episode. We did it. We did it up. I appreciate everybody that tuned in last episode. Uh, it was legendary. Last episode went in, went down in the books. I ain't gonna lie to you. Last episode went down in the books. Legendary books for sure, for sure. Been watching every stream. Shout out to uh Check from OC. Been watching every stream. I feel you, Tiny got the best come up on FMW here. Regular nigga like us with a job. Facts. I am a regular nigga. And then you know what's crazy? Um, when you hear people say, like, I was a re- I'm was, i a regular nigga. I, if I could do it, you could do it. Or if I could do it, anybody could do it. When it's some shit like that, and you really don't be believing it. Like, nigga, hell, nah. That shit ain't, that shit ain't for everybody like that, but... Really, like you could be somebody regular and then just do anything. For real, for real, the sky is the limit. I ain't catch it live. <clears throat> Hell yeah, I was loving them super chat my wars. That shit did it up. Jose, what's up with you? I see you. See what you're new. Make sure y'all go subscribe to his new page and all that. Everything you feel me? We all won. That's a fact. Yeah, nah, you always hear that shit like, oh, you can do anything. I swear, if I could do it, you could do it. But like, y'all seeing it in real life, in real time with me, for sure, for sure. And I know y'all, if Tiny can do it, y'all can do it. Definitely. That's why I be encouraging motherfuckers to, to, they be like, man, I be thinking about starting a podcast. I don't even, I mean, I guess I am a podcaster, but I really don't even consider myself a podcaster. I don't know why I don't consider myself a podcaster. I feel like I'm more a streamer than a podcaster. So, yeah. But whatever the case is, push play on that motherfucker. Push live. Go live. Do the live. That's what really, you feel me, get the... You got to jump in the pool, man. You got to jump in the pool. And you can't skip the process. And And then it's like... It's kind of beauty in the process, though, if you think about it. It's beauty in the process because it's like when you get to tell your story at the end when you made it, like when Steve Harvey be like, oh, I slept in the car for two years, even though he probably capping. But whatever he did for that two years, that's like I work for Apollo. I, I did Apollo, didn't get paid for two years. That's like part of the journey. I sat in my car while I was at work and went live in the car that's part of like the that's part of the journey that's part of the journey that's like me putting in work but i'm so i'm already so invested now it's like it's crazy but yeah so you got it you can't skip the process let me see your neck there i don't got no neck on it damn you know i do got a neck nigga i got my neck tatted too nigga on which side is on I think I said, let me see your neck. They did used to say I was all head and shoulders when I had my helmet and shoulder pads on. Shout out to uh, Crook the Loke, though. He said one, uh, 199. He said, let me see your neck. I appreciate you sending your chili, you know what I'm saying? I do got a neck, though, nigga. Fuck you. <clears throat> hey, let's get to 6K today. Let me get 6K today. Let's get to 6K. We close to 6K. I don't know how many more subscribers we need to get to 6K, but whatever it is, let's reach that goal, people. So make sure y'all share this. Y'all go like this. Y'all tell people to go subscribe. 
I, burners, whatever. I don't give a fuck how I go. I'm just looking for 6K. I'm trying to reach 6K by the end of the night, man. That's what I'm trying to do. Believe it. Talking about my neck. But yeah, they used to tell, they used to call me head and shoulders and shit when I used to have my helmet on with the shoulder pads. And then when I run, I run like, I don't run stiff, but I run like with my shoulders up. I run with my shoulders up. So when I run with, with my shoulders up, then you feel me? Drebo, tell her what they used to, my nigga Drebo in the building. It's a her. Shout out to Drebo sending super chat. Hey, tell them they used to, what they used to say in football, man. I was still doing my shit, though. I was still doing my shit, but yeah, they used to say Tiny ain't got no neck and all that. So yeah, I heard that joke before, nigga. I do got a neck, and I got. That's why I got my neck tat. Y'all, y'all can't see my neck tat. What side is on? That shit went away. Oh, I can't even see it. Whatever the case is, it's a it's a tat. I got a tat on my neck, nigga. Believe that. Know that. <clears throat> Make sure y'all like this video on the way in. And when you uh and type where you watching this from, you from you for sure run right with your shoulders shrugged. Ah! <laughs> I'm fast though. I still think I'm fast. I just can't run full dis like long distance fast. I'm whooped out of shape fast. Oh yeah, speaking out of shape, there is a uh uh a gym around the corner from here. But to start up a gym membership, that shit like 174. I'm about to try. I'm looking for Planet Fitness. I need the Planet Fitness one dollar. Somebody calling me. What the fuck? Oh, did my I think the car probably turned off. Whatever the case is, can y'all hear me? I just heard a beat. Tiny with the hand of tattoos is crazy. Can y'all hear me though? Cause I just heard a beep. I don't know if that beep mean that y'all can't hear me or what. We hear you. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. All right, cool. They hear me. Yeah, Planet Fitness, yeah, $10. I got to find a Planet Fitness around here. I went over here. It's all high power, good shit over here. They like, bruh. It's going to be like 174 to start off. I'm like, 174 to start off? That's going to force me to go. Uh, What's up? You need me to see this, that, this, the truck I try to move for. I think he good. Yeah, he good. Fuck that nigga. I say fuck that nigga after I move for him. But yeah. Ty, you think you beating Flock on the race? I know for a fact I'm beating Flock on the race. If I lose the Flock on the race, that's nasty. That's nasty. But yeah, so like 174, I told them niggas I'll come back. But they did look like there's better living in there. I think they had a pool in there. Little hot sauna, all that. Planet Fitness don't give you that. The Planet Fitness just give you the little, you lay down on a little massage bed and then you put the little shit on. You could go aggressive or whatever. That's all Planet Fitness got for you. But this shit look like it has some better living shit in there. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to try to, uh, yeah, 175 to join is crazy. 175 to join. But I am looking for a Planet Fitness over here, though. God, like I said, I start that motherfucker $10 Ten dollars. I tell him I know bees, cause B said he used to work there or something. So hopefully his name is good. Hopefully his name is good in these streets. If his name good in these streets, then yeah, I could probably get it for free. Oh no, it's not one seventy five every month. That's just the starter fee, cause they want the first, the last, and they treating this motherfucker like it's rent. They treating that motherfucker like it's rent. I walked in there. They like, yeah, we need a deposit first last month. And all that. I'm like, bruh, they got to run a credit check and all type of shit. I'm like, bruh, am I getting an apartment or am I trying to get a gym membership around this bitch? That shit was crazy. They want first and last for the gym membership. And some other first time fee, whatever. That shit came with the 170 photo. I wasn't expecting that. I'm thinking it's going to be like the motherfucking uh, <clears throat> Planet Fitness, $10. $1 for your first month. It's free or some shit. Planet Fitness is where it's at. <clears throat> they want all type of shit. 
Yeah, hell yeah. I, shit, 174, I'm going to make sure my damn self is committed. I ain't got no damn 174 to be just doing a look like that. I got to really go. So, uh, Crook the Crook the Loke sent another super chat after talking about my neck. He said, uh, I got two more bucks for the gym membership. All right, appreciate that. We're going to put that to the gym membership uh, pot. We're going to put that. So, now I just need... Uh, 170, what's that, 172? No, 174. Yeah. <clears throat> but yeah, how everybody doing, man? Did y'all wear y'all green today? That's what I want to know. Did, did everybody wear that green today? That gym is doing the look, yeah. Proof of address. <laughs> yeah, they want to know proof of address. I got to give them check stubs. They wanted check stubs. First and last, had to run the credit check. And I had to, uh, it was all type of shit. I told her I'll be back. Remember my face. Yeah. Her, shout out seven seven says some chili her fifth super chat i appreciate seven she said here go five on it i got five on it chat what y'all got on it yeah oh yeah put that pressure put that pressure i like that applying that pressure <clears throat> and a, a set up auto paypal that's crazy that auto paypal that they be trying to get a nigga with that shit like, we just going to take it every month on the 7th. Don't worry about it. As soon as the 6th come, I take all the money out. Then they try to take it on the 7th. Now it's all controversy. What's going on? We can't get our chili. You can't get your chili. Oh, it ain't in there. It's supposed to be in there. Then it's all back and forth. Checking into the savings and the savings into the checking. And then shit, by the time it's at the end, it's gone. It's done. Shit. You two months behind now. Got to get it in. <clears throat> yeah. Big deal in the chat. He said uh he's starting his new channel. Yeah, yeah, they politicked on his own channel, man. They play a chess. So yeah, go follow Big Deal if you fuck with Big Deal and his movement. Go follow his new page and his new channel. Uh, Kane sent some chili, sent a dub. That's right. He said, I'll raise you. That's right. I like the little mob wars. It don't got to be mob wars, though. I don't like war because war seems like we, you know, we battling and we all together. So it's not, uh, I don't want to say war. Uh, we got to come up with a better word or something. Mod something. Mod, uh. Cause we together, so my building, not my wars. I don't know. Whenever that comes to me, I think about it. We are battling. Nah, we not battling. We all together. I don't want to battle. <clears> oh <throat> uh, yeah. Uh, my ties. Yeah, I like that. My ties, but then some people be looking at ties like uh like negative and shit. I don't look at ties as negative. I pay my ties even if I don't go to I, now ties. I got ties on auto pay. <laughs> <laughs> don't care. I got my ties on auto pay because I forget or I won't like nah. Just go to take yours, Jesus. Get what you gotta get. Get yours first out the account. Boom. It did let me thug, my, let me do the rest of my thug thizzle. Like, cause I forget. So for sure, my ties is, uh, my ties is in, what you call it? When they just take it every week. That's funny. I fuck with ties though. Everybody don't like ties, but I like ties though. You know what I'm saying? If you like ties, then we could call it my ties. But yeah, trying to get me a job. I'm trying to get myself a job. No kizzy. Rimshot. I haven't did quote of the day in the whole 2000, 
I don't think I did it in 2024. Quote of the day, I got to bring, I, I for sure got to bring quote of the day back. Definitely. Yeah. Come spread freedom, democracy, earth needs your soldier. Yeah. Hey, so who, uh, who been watching Rolling Loud? Who went to Rolling Loud? Who went, anybody in the chat went to Rolling Loud? Or anybody, what you call it, watch Rolling Loud? I fuck with Rolling Loud because I really like performances. Going to a Rolling Loud, uh, I, well, I'm not really a festival person because whenever I do go to a festival or I have been to, to a festival, I'm always better living in the back on some shit. I ain't been to a festival where it had to be with with the the regulars, you know what I'm saying? I'll be with the high powers in the back. Uh and the festival is if it's a it's different from a club performance or uh just if you have a show like a festival is different. It's way more people, it's outside. I feel like it's other people performing. So it's not really competition because you can't but it is competition, if that makes sense. Because it ain't, it's like, if it's your show, you know who performing, and then boom, you headline at the end. You know what I'm saying? But when it's a festival, it's big dogs there. It's big dogs at the festivals. You know what I'm saying? You know how you see how the, that flyer be? It be the little small names. Just niggas just be happy to get their little name small on that little flyer. It be at the bottom. Boom. Oh, my name made the flyer. But then as it go higher to the headline, the big dog names be big dog. You know what I'm saying? Uh, it's Aki sent uh, 499. He said, uh, my motivation, congregation plate. Oh, my motivation, congregation plate. I like that. Laugh it around, pass it around, keep it going, tiny. It's a herd. Yeah, I like that. I like that. Congregation plate. Pass the collection plate around. I wish I had that soundboard me and Drebo had. Drebo has. Ain't that the truth? We had some cold shit. We made, we made some legendary shit, Drebo. If you still in here. Uh, Crook the Loak sent some more chili. He said, you think about the Steelers this year? What you think about the Steelers this year, bro? I'm going to get to the Steelers. I'm going to get to the Steelers. Uh, I fuck with that pickup. I don't know why the... I don't know why the... Uh, I want to... All right, I'm going to just get to the Steelers right now since you sent the chili, and I'm going to forget. But I'm going to try to go back to Rolling Loud. I want to go back to Rolling Loud. But basically... uh. The Steelers, I like that they picked up Fields. I like they picked up Russell Wilson because he ain't, ain't got to pay that nigga. And he a vet. And then I like that they picked up Fields. I like that everybody black in the situation. The coach black, both quarterbacks black. The team just feel black. It's just a black team. I fuck with black teams. So, yeah, I, I like the Steelers picking up uh, Justin Fields. And then I think they got Queen, too. Patrick Queen, from the, uh, if I'm not mistaken, from the Ravens. So that was another tight pickup. I, if I'm the Bears, I don't trade Justin Fields right away, though. I keep Justin, even if I'm about to trade, I mean, even if I'm about to draft Caleb Williams or whoever I'm about to draft with the first pick, I'm still going to keep uh, your boy Fields until, because somebody always get hurt in preseason or training camp, a quarterback always get hurt. So then I would have traded that nigga then. I trade that nigga when a quarterback get hurt. Because then once a quarterback get hurt, shit. You feel me? The quarterback hurt. Niggas be needing the quarterback at the end of the day. So that's what I that's what I would have did. I would have saved him. Because they gave that nigga up like a, for a sixth round or a fourth round or some shit. Third round. Fourth fourth if he play. Third if he don't play or some shit. Whatever the case is. Like they, they I feel like they could have got more from that nigga. But yeah, that's what I think about him right now. Uh, Crook the low shout out to you though. Uh, I like Sprite. Said pass the uh plate. It's a herd. That's right. I like Sprite. Yeah, pass that. Pass that plate all down. You know what I'm saying? Pass that plate all down. And if you feel legitimate, God is good. Uh, God is greater. Uh, pass that collection plate around. <laughs> I remember Jamie Foxx did that. That shit was funny. He said the church had you all hyped up. 
they preach it all good and then right when you feel it good, they say pass the collection plate around. That shit was funny, bro, because it do be like that. God is good. God is greater. Ah, pass that collection plate around. <laughs> <laughs> oh man yeah but yeah but uh back to rolling loud like so the festivals is cool i remember coachella coachella was the only festival i really wasn't high power i was high power day one nor day two i think it was two days whatever the day because q performed one day and then dot perform the last day so i think cube headline saturday and then die headline sunday or some shit like that and saturday i was the man saturday i could i was going everywhere with the wristband i could do anything i could go here there boom 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 sunday and i got my bitch ass kicked right back to out there with the regulars and i'm like bruh how am i supposed to everybody in the back and shit but it was it was high power Sunday. Sunday they like yeah don't even worry about it. Don't even worry about it. So I did, but I did watch uh, Kendrick shit. Yeah, Smokers Club, Smoker Club went up. Smoker Club went up. Uh, I did do Kendrick shit or watch Kendrick shit from the crowd, and uh, that was tight. That was tight watching kid. It's like talking about mosh pit. It do be crazy. That's why I like. Uh, I could see, not to bring this up, but the Travis Scott switching the handset. Is that? I think that's my phone tripping. <clears throat> you gotta make your quote of the day, quote of what you call it. Man, it's a lot that I want to do. I just got, I gotta get a team. I ain't be, I got, that's not my strong suit. That's not my strong suit. I sound far away now. Yeah, something happened. Oh, hold on. Can y'all hear me? We can still hear you. The sound changed. It's because I've been hearing. But it, but it. Is it? Do what is? What's going on? It's not a hurt. Oh man, what's going on? This is why I don't like doing this shit like this. Maybe from the car, yeah, radio. Okay, I think I'm bounced back. I'll probably bounce back. Sound muffled, sounds lower. Burly. It's crazy because y'all be behind, so I got to give it a little time for it to catch up. Fair to say. You sound cool to me. All right. Cool. So, yeah, back to... uh. Back to the festivals and shit. Oh. Damn, do I got the other phone in the other car? I gotta go to the other car. I'm gonna go to 7-Eleven. I'm gonna make my 7-Eleven run then. Fuck it. But the festivals been up, though. Festivals been going up. I prefer, just like the Super Bowl, I prefer to watch the Super Bowl at the house. Like, the Super Bowl seemed cool and all that to be there, but I'd rather watch the Super Bowl at the house. The Super Bowl at the house is where uh hey, I'm about to plug this in. Tell me if y'all can hear me still. Cause my phone. Oh, uh, you know. Can y'all hear me good? Better than trying to Hell no, nah, I ain't spending 200 a week on no damn scratch-offs. Ah, uh, yeah, I'm good. Okay, cool. But yeah, nah, shot. I wouldn't, I wouldn't, I wouldn't want to go to the Super Bowl. The Super Bowl, I'd rather watch the Super Bowl like at home. I just feel like it's just too much going on at the Super Bowl. And you can't like uh you can't like the Super Bowl commercials, you like you. It's cool, but you ain't going to be at the function with your family and shit, like the Super Bowl parties. Like, I go to the Super Bowl, but I'd rather watch it with the homies in, like, in that setting than be at the game. And I feel the same way with festivals. Like, festivals, I'd rather watch the festival on YouTube because it's too much shit going on in the festival. It's too much shit going on in the festival for you to keep up with everything. 
It's like, God damn. It's too much shit. I'm going, uh, they got three different fucking uh, stages. I'm trying to keep up with all the, uh, I'm trying to keep up with who going next. I got to go to this YouTube stage, to this YouTube stage. So imagine me being there. Some people I wouldn't even try, try even try to see. Some people I ain't even worried about it. Some people I'm like, yeah, shame on you. It do look lit though. I say I would say it do look lit. Uh, I'll make sure I turn the car off. Somebody be still niggas be stealing cars. Hey, where my neck tat at, girl? I can't even see my neck tat no more. That's crazy. They got me hot. That nigga said something about my neck. I can't even find my neck tat. What's up with it? You all right? You know I'm doing my thing. I'm in front of millions and millions of people watching me go to 7-Eleven and get the same shit that I get every day. We're getting a bottle of water. But look, 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 look. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. I kind of elevated. I was getting these little buses, 7-Eleven seven, uh, 7 waters, but now I've been on these right here. These pH waters. I've been on these pH waters. You know what I'm saying? I love the door. Yeah. Let me see. Let me see. Hold on. Let me see. What kind? I do want some candy too. Last time, look, y'all remember when I bought these last time? The motherfucking that's the time they stole my car and they, they stole these out the car. That's crazy. That shit crazy. Uh, what's up? What y'all got? Y'all got? Oh, y'all only y'all have no guapa leaves, huh? No, bro. Just uh, backwards, huh? I just them by four or five. About a four or five. They they still open? God damn. But y'all, why y'all don't carry, uh, you don't know, huh? I'm asking, that's above your pay grade. You don't know why they don't got no motherfucking back with. Oh, uh, yeah, that's it. Y'all trying to get my code, huh? I ain't giving y'all my code. Good luck, and let me get a scratcher too. Oh, uh, you know what? That's crazy. I was looking for this. What number? What number y'all think I should get, people? I got ten dollars. I got ten dollars. What number y'all think I should get, people? I think I won on eighteen last time, and I lost on number twenty-three last time. So what are we getting? What number, y'all? Somebody said number seven. Where number seven at? That's twenty dollars. I only got ten dollars. Y'all talking about numbers? I only got ten dollars. Get two number fives. Nigga, y'all tripping. Number eight, I can't, I gotta go from 13 and under. Number 12, I see 12. Where 12 at? The big, what's that? Red yeah. hot cash? Yeah. All right. We're going with number 12. Fuck it. Give me 10 on 12. Say it like it's gas. Let me get 10 on 12. What time can I uh, collect collect it though? Cause last time you said I can't cash my check here. I mean, not cash my but I can't cash my ticket in here. Um, the time you can cash it from six to twelve, I think. To, to midnight. Yeah. All right. All right, man. Well, Sunday is closed a little bit earlier. And... All right. 
I appreciate you, man. I'll see you next time. Yeah. Hopefully we win a million. Hopefully we win a million. I spend that's what I'm saying. I just spent my fucking twenty dollars at 7 Eleven. All I got was a scratcher, two waters, and some gummy worms. And that shit was twenty dollars. Not even some gummy worms, but some Skittles. Some gummy Skittles. That shit twenty dollars, kid. God damn. Inflation. And all type of fuckery. For real. Yeah. Making sure they shit straight. I ain't I ain't laugh. Floyd, I ain't laughing or bothering nobody, Floyd. Floyd be talking about leave the homeless people alone. There's that needles on the ground. Shit. Scissors? She got scissors? That's for sure, scissors. Yeah, that's the wrong person that has some scissors on the ground next to. God damn. You got scissors on the ground. You don't want to fuck with people with scissors. <clears throat> so, yeah. Let me get back to the motherfucking Coachella. Golly. Coachella three-day event. Four-day event, really. Thursday, they said Kanye West performed. I did not see that shit. Did anybody, uh, did anybody see Kanye West performance Thursday? Because that's what I didn't see. Shout out to Kanye. I'm a big Kanye fan, but I did not get to see Kanye at the motherfucking, uh, I don't even know why he went Thursday. That shit don't even make sense. He went Thursday. You know what I'm saying? I know there's a lot of parties and shit going on. Then uh, he showed up, walked around stage, and left. You lying? He didn't perform. He didn't. He performed. I like what Kanye do. Welcome to the good life. Boop, boop. Boop, boop. That's it, babe. Welcome to the good life. I know that that's Kanye's song, but that's who's that T Pain singing? Yeah, I like what Kanye performed that though. Welcome to the good life. Tiny time travel to Coachella. Yeah, I oh yeah, Coachella. Coachella was tight, though. I got some videos on my Snapchat that I'll probably release for me at Coachella and shit. That nigga Q, I was about to have a damn asthma attack with all that dust. And then we had to leave and shit, nigga. Had to like a boulevard be like, oh, I can't breathe. The dust is fucking with me. Yeah, like, he's a good. <clears throat> so yeah, Thursday I didn't see shit. I didn't see nothing on uh <clears throat> I didn't see no Coachella. I mean no rolling out on Thursday. Hey, come to think of it, I think Q performed at the first, I think he headlined the first ever Coachella, if I'm not mistaken. I remember going to that shit too. I remember going to that shit. Uh it's hella smoke stays. Yeah, it's been playing old track for 15 minutes long. He's been gone. Uh, so he just got the chili. He just got the chili and got up out of there. I knew he wasn't. They didn't advertise it right. That's how I knew it was some bullshit because they didn't even advertise it right. I'm like, ain't no motherfucking way Kanye West there and niggas ain't heard about it or know about it. So that's all. That's really, that's truth in the details. He just got a check. Just put my name on there Thursday. Because it's supposed to be Friday. Can you even buy a Thursday ticket? I thought it was just a three-day, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. I never seen, like, a four-day pass. Kanye just stole some money from them niggas. Shout out to Kanye. <clears throat> nah, I'm not calling it Coachella. It was rolling loud, but I went to a Coachella. I think I probably did say that. Uh, yeah, I said the first Coachella. Yeah, first rolling loud, yeah. Thursday tickets was 170. God damn. To watch Kanye and some smoke on the screen. They could have gave me that 170 so I could have went to the gym. Cause that's how much it costs to start up the gym shit. 170. For real, for real. Make sure y'all like this video. Do all that. Put where you from if you just enter in the chat. We're trying to get to 6K. Well, I'm trying to get to 6K. Uh 
I'm trying to get to 6K subscribers by the end of the night. I know I'm close. I don't know how many I need, but I know we on the road to 6K, and I can see the finish line right there. So, yeah, let's get to 6K. Let's get to 6K. Did I – uh making sure I ain't skip nothing. All right. Um. So, yeah. All right, let's go with Friday. Friday, I forgot uh, Rolling Loud was even on. So when I turned in on YouTube, Zoe Osama was performing. Zoe Osama was performing. They had three different stages. I don't know, Ethica and some other shit and some other shit. The Sprite, I think it was a Sprite stage or it was probably sponsored by Sprite. I don't know. Whatever the case was, I was, my ass was going through one, one screen to another screen to another screen. So when I first turned it on, it was Zoe Osama. Bitch, I'm on the blade. Switch bang. Switch bang. Put it up, little bitch. Put it up, little bitch. Yeah, he was performing. Uh, He was straight. I seen him perform already, though, at Jason Cash shit. Shout out to my boy, Jason Cash. I seen him perform today, too. Shout out to Jason Cash again. But uh, I seen Zoe Sama perform at Jason Cash. Uh, uh, There we go. Six tight. Six. No, what are you talking about? Ethica, GoPuff, and Culture Kings. I'm talking about Sprite. I, if that's what I say. It must have been sponsored by Sprite because everything was obey your thirst and all type of thirst. And I seen a lot of Sprite shit. But yeah, then was the three Ethica, Go Puff, and Culture Kings. Uh, <clears throat> but yeah, so I seen him perform at Jason Cash shit. That was cool. So I wasn't I already kind of knew what he was, what he what he was up to. He was straight. Not really a festival to me. I it's like it's cool, but it wasn't. It was whatever. It was whatever. Then uh I didn't see AZ Chike, but I saw on YouTube today, I mean on YouTube on Instagram, I think Yaz posted or somebody posted it that he was uh in a crowd performing movies. That's tight. That's tight. Cause that shit looked like it was fun. It looked like it was a lot going on, but it looked like it was fun. And uh, you know, Fox 5 Channel 9 a good movie. Nah, 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 nah. That shit, that shit, bang. So I, I'm mad I didn't see that. I'm gonna try to go back and look for that on YouTube because I do want to see that live performance too. I got bitches, I got, I got set up, I got drop. That shit, bang. <clears throat> so yeah, Az Tyke, shout out to you doing your shit. You know what I'm saying in the crowd. I don't know how many uh festival bangers like that that you got, but for sure. That's one of the ones. The nigga was in the crowd performing. That shit go crazy. Uh, well, oh, then after, but I did see uh, Make America Sexy again. I did see Sexy Red. Ski! Sexy Red. Whoo! Sexy Red. She got, all right, let me tell you this. They grind me anyway, because when they was recording or when they was showing the shit on TV, on YouTube, they had panned to the crowd, and then they were showing the niggas rapping Sexy Red song. And I feel like you could like Sexy Red songs, but shit, no nigga be uh, reciting any of her lyrics at all. No lyrics. Maybe Ski Eat. And even Ski Eat is still kind of like a little borderline, because she just make it sound like niggas shouldn't be saying it. So, yeah. But, uh... Yeah, they kept panning to the crowd, and then you just see motherfuckers just rapping her shit. That was out of pocket, kid. So if you was at Rolling Loud, you might want to go back and look at that uh, her set and see if the camera panned on you and your ass right there. I think I see six over there. I think I see six. They panned the six. He talk about. <laughs> <laughs> He fed the city talking about fuck my baby daddy, kid. <laughs> I'm like, is that six talking about fuck my baby daddy? But I don't think it was six. I think six was on the other side. Six was at the other uh, stage. <laughs> I was just playing, kid. But oh my God. But yeah. Because it was, uh, then yeah, what's that song? I thought she was going to bring her out. I thought she was going to bring that nigga out. Whoever so that is, I think Young Nudie, if I'm not mistaken. 
she got her own little version that I never heard that shit with. I'm like, oh my God, bro. Sexy Red is out of pocket. Then they pan to the crowd, and then you got the niggas still rapping her lyrics. I'm like, oh, no. Nah. <laughs> oh, no. <nah. laughs> uh, but Sexy Red, she did her shit, though. She got a lot of slappers. She a great performer. She get the crowd going. She got slappers. She was shaking that ass. Uh, she was singing. She tried to hit some notes or something. Whatever it was, I like, I fuck with her. She did, she did it up. She did it up. <clears throat> boop, 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 boop. <laughs> I was live shit the whole time. Yeah, nah, for sure. I was just playing six. Six wasn't there. I just you just in the chat and you was the only person that I could really throw that on. And you just made the joke funny, kid. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't gonna put that on six. He wasn't talking about fuck his baby daddy or none of that. But if y'all do go to the YouTube and shit, y'all will see what I'm talking about, how they had the cameras uh panning on the the, the the males and they still was doing uh rapping they shit. <clears throat> uh who was who else was that? Oh after her it was Ray Shermer on Friday. Back Biddles in the cities and then it really really I didn't even know the motherfucker was bald headed. I thought them niggas had dreads. I thought both of them had dreads. Now one of the niggas bald headed and then I didn't know the other nigga I think Sway Lee I didn't know he was a singer like that. Like, he be singing. He be singing a lot. And uh, I don't know the other dude's name, but I know Sway Lee. The other dude ball-headed now. But, yeah, that was, uh, that was a good performance. That was a good performance. I remember I seen them perform already, too. That was at the Dub Car Show. Uh, this was a while back. But that's when they had, like, up like Donald Trump. Up like Donald Trump. They played that. That shit went crazy. But, uh... <clears throat> yeah, Ray Sherman, they had a good performance. They got they had old songs and shit, niggas. Niggas forgot all about them. I like that. Drop top not tell you right now. What comes up must comes down. I like that song. Drop top not top. Okay, big up from the UK. It's a herd. That's right. Shout out to you. Cash app link. Oh, yeah. Hey, drop the cash app link, die. Damn. Drop top not touch you right now. Yeah, so, yeah, they did good. Shout out to uh, Ray Shermer. Then after that, it was Tyga and YG. Tyga and YG. Mm, 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 mm. First off, when did they become a group? Why do I keep saying Tyga and YG? That's, that's like me when I hear... Uh, Mac Joaquin and Tiny, or such and such and Tiny. Like, why do I hear Tiger and YG, or YG and Tiger? I don't even get that shit. They could have did two separate things, but never the case. They performed together, and then they did like a little verses, and YG just washed Tiger. Like, I never knew. Like, I'm, I never was the biggest. Like, I'm not a Tiger fan at all, but. Like, I never knew. I thought Tiger, I don't know. I always thought Tiger was more popular or famous than YG. But when you do their music together, oh my God, it's, it's, he running laps on them. All Tiger had for him is do, do, do. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Hey, hey. That's his, that's all he got. Do, do, do. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I don't know who I did was for them to do a versus. Like on uh, Tiger got bangers. Tiger do not got no bangers, homie. Tiger got way more bangers. You crazy. Y'all crazy. Oh, yeah. Mike out of town. Yeah, okay. Now, if we talking out of town, probably. All right. If we talking global and across the USA, yeah. If we talking about LA and we talking about some shit, Tiger is getting laps ran around. Laps. Okay, Tiger got the city. I mean, YG got the city. Tiger got overseas. Okay, I like that answer. I agree with that answer. I agree with that answer. But I never knew, like, when I heard the songs together, when Tiger played one, then 
YG play one, then Tiger play one, then YG play one. I never knew like, like it was like he don't got as many hits as as YG in the in LA. I would say <clears throat> Tiger get no play out here. I right, caramba. Hey, who said that? Who's BW? I be saying I right, caramba. Uh. We don't hear YG like that. Yeah, Tiger, Tiger's, that's what I said. I always thought Tiger was the bigger artist, but when we go on songs and performance and all that, just stage presence, like YG got that shit way over Tiger. Tiger, every song Tiger got, he got a feature. Like he don't, he don't really got too many songs that he could stand alone on and he could perform. YG got songs he could stand alone and perform. Uh, Tiger, he got he got to have a feature. Every song he play, he just doing his verse or something, and then he got to switch the song. He ain't got nothing where he could play a whole song. Yeah. What comes up must come down. Who flow better, Tiger or King Terrell? Shit, they rap the same, nigga. <laughs> They definitely rapped the same. But yeah, then so that was Friday. I didn't I didn't see Nicki Minaj. I would have watched Nicki Minaj. I ain't, I ain't got no problem watching Nicki Minaj. I think I was playing a game or so. I don't know why I didn't watch Nicki Minaj. Oh, I think I had to come to work. I think I had to come to work why I didn't watch Nicki Minaj. Whatever the case was, I didn't get to see Nicki Minaj. But did she anybody watch Nicki Nicki Minaj? Did she perform? I wish that I can have this moment for life. Well, that's too old for her. Or that, dude, shawty, you don't, like, shawty, you tell me you the realest, not that I not do, you know, shawty, I'm in front you the realest, you got swag, that you got slunk, yeah. Your love, your love, bitch. Yeah, that's a, your love. Did she play your love? Did she play that? Did anybody watch that? <clears throat> they cut her string. Damn, that's crazy. Shawty, I didn't tell you one and one and made it. And I not go. They probably cut her water off because she do be high power. She probably came late thinking she about to perform all night. They like, hell no, you ain't performing all night. You got to set time. You got smart. Yeah, you got smart. You like a kind of thug. Your love, your love. That's Nicki Minaj's best song. I don't care what nobody said. That's Nicki Minaj's best song. ba da ba da ba 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 Oh, but I better be put back. Oh, Shawnee, I tell you, I need a real list. Nothing I not do. That shit, fake, yeah. I ain't heard that in a long time, but if she perform that, that'll be tight. I gotta see her perform that. <clears throat> your love, your love, bitch. I'm just driving around. I, I felt like where I was parked that I was parked there too long. There you go. Be moving and shit. I don't like being parked in one spot too long. Your love, your love, bitch. <clears throat> okay. Don't play with the barbs. Nah, I'm not. Bees in a trap. Nah, I didn't like that. I don't like all that. Man, now that song all in my head. Y'all know what song I'm talking about too. That shit used to go crazy. So yeah, that was a uh, that was Friday night. I did see AD karaoke set. Yeah, AD did his shit. I I did karaoke. I think that was Illa birthday. I went over there to a uh, ladies' night, and then we was doing karaoke in the other room and shit. Uh, I fuck with karaoke. That's what I wanted to do at the live show. But Terrell and them sabotaged our set and didn't give us no DJ. They knew I was going to go up in that motherfucker. They like, nah, we can't give Tiny no, no DJ. <laughs> oh. Damn, my phone on three. Can y'all hear me? I just plugged it up. Tiny getting on the cypher. Nah, they don't think I can rap. 
But you know it's crazy when they when they leave me off shit, or when I don't, uh, you know, I just do my own. I might do my own cipher. You spelled the wrong. See, yeah, that's why. Where die at? Die know how to do it. Die gone. Now nah, you spelled it right. Seven for the cash app. Oh, so so she did spell it right. Let me let me pin it. Somebody asked for my cash app. Shout out to you who asked for my cash app. I'm gonna pin seven. Uh, message. That is the cash app. Tiny Deuce. You know what I'm saying. <clears throat> Oh, I don't want to tell you really. Okay, so that was Friday night. All right, let's go to Saturday. Can y'all, uh, can y'all, what you call it? Can y'all hear me? Cause I just plugged this phone back up to the charge. I gotta make sure y'all can hear me before I keep going. You're a lyrical rapper or coming through our gang slide edition. I'm a, uh, I'm a storyteller rapper. I have my uh I remember that that got my vans on, got my vans on, but it looked like sneakers. Remember that I had a song to that. Fuck Nike, Reeboks, and Adidas. Vans are my favorite shoes in the world. I got all colors. You can ask any girl. I walk in a van tour, bought this van T. It cost $15 cause it was 3D. Now only looking for some shoes to match. So I walk over to this fucking shoe rack. See these black and white. Man, see these black and white. Three vans go good. Some y'all gotta hear the y'all gotta hear y'all gotta have a beat on there. It's out tight with the beat. It's out tight with the beat. Yeah. Wait, what? Wait, how do you spell deuce? How do you spell? Because some people spell it D-U-C-E. I put the D-E-U-C-E. How you spell deuce? <clears throat> Y'all tell me this stuff. I really have flows. I really can rap, kid. Got my vans on, but it look like sneakers. Yeah. That was my shit. That wasn't it, fam. That's because you all got the beat. You all got the beat. So that's why you saying it ain't what you call it. Damn, you got no talent. Cause I definitely got talent. That's why you ain't here watching me. You got to have some talent to have some people watching you. That's what I'm saying. Just put me in front of the uh, in front of a stage. And then I'm a moonwalk like B's son. Shout out to B's son. I don't know if y'all seen B's son moonwalking all on stage. He had a talent show. I don't know if he won. But he definitely performed Michael Jackson. Uh oh, should I follow him? Let me see. Oh shit, it's a, it might be real. Let's see how far they going though, because last time these niggas be going too far, and I can't, I ain't, I can't keep up with these motherfuckers. They be going too far. I'm trying to catch catch the light. I'm gonna give them like six lights. If they pass six lights, I ain't going, I ain't following them no more. <clears throat> Shawty, I've been running on you the realest. Oh, they turning. I can't even turn. Oh, it's a red light. It's red light for me. Oh shit. Oh, they 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 right there with a the girl with the lady with the scissors. Oh shit. Oh shit. That's crazy. Hurry up. The light red. They went back. They right here where the ladies, because they at the 7 Eleven. And the lady with the scissors. I should go straight and come the other way. That's crazy. Look, 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 look. I'm about to show y'all. It's a fucking red light, though. Oh my God, bruh. They got me hot with this red light. Hold on. Hold on. They got me hot with this red light, bruh. Ain't no motherfucking way. This light, this is a long ass red light, bruh. Wow. Damn. 
Run through the lights. I ain't stopping at no lights. They want to pay the price. Dunking on them like I'm Blake Griffin. They go to 7-Eleven, I watch. Oh, wait. Hold on. No, that's her. She good. Where they at? Hold on. She good. She good right there. She the one with the scissors. Where these niggas going? Oh, they just looked at me. Ah, oh, shit. What's going on? Now I'm in between the motherfucking... Look at... I'm funny, kid. I got somebody behind me and these niggas in front of me. Oh, they done. <clears throat> they turned their lights off. I guess she was straight. I guess it was a false call. I guess it was a false call. <clears throat> oh, that's wild. That's crazy. All right. Where was I at? That was that must have been a false call or something. That was a false call. Dunking on them like I'm Blake Griffin. Mm-hmm. They right here next to me and shit. I ain't never want to be no fireman. Fireman's is low key like uh. Hey, the firemen's is low key. They like uh, they like nurses, kinda. They like nurses. What the fuck was that? The car just start beeping red. Hey, fire firemen's is like nurses though, cause they all they get to the scene first. They be the ones that gotta, you know, aid the people. Like, I feel like they do more aid doing that, like how they just went to the to the lady more than putting out fires. I mean, yeah, they got to put out fires every now and then, for sure, for sure, but I feel like, for the most part, them motherfuckers be, uh... <clears throat> for the most part, them motherfuckers be going to houses and being motherfucking nurses, saving lives. Dunking on them like I'm Blake Griffin. Mm-hmm. I know, I was, but I ain't stopping at no lights. Tony stopped at the lights. <laughs> mm-hmm. Dunking on them like I'm Blake Griffin. Get a scanner. That is true. Get a scanner. Oh, I like that. The scanner will go crazy. Firefighters be cool till they get that serious call. Yeah, no, nah, they be... Uh, I fuck with firefighters. They be first response, real shit. They come first before anybody. They come before the police. They come before the ambulance. The fire truck always there first. That's why I fuck with the fire truck. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Dunking on, they just driving around with their motherfucking sirens on because clearly we seen them not pick up nobody right there, right? We see, we clearly saw them not pick up nobody and everything was copacetic, but they still driving. They ain't driving fast, so they not it's not an emergency. They just got their sirens on because it's late night. Niggas do whatever they want late night. Niggas do whatever they want late night. Make sure y'all like this video. Uh, please subscribe if you're not subscribed. I'm trying to get 6K. I don't know how many I need to get to 6K. Can somebody tell me how many I need? How many I need to get to 6K? Hey, that citizens app, that motherfucker, that citizens app is brutal. <clears throat> Excuse me. That citizens app make your nigga want to cry, homie. It be so much shit going on. Stabbing two blocks north, forty three hundred block. Like God damn, robbery. Like it, it's never no good shit. Why the citizen app don't got no good shit on there? Don't no good shit be happening, or it's only for bad shit when bad shit happen. Mm hmm. Dunking on them like I'm Blake Griffin.
I need 80 more people. Y'all know what I mean? Say, I need 80 more people. I got 306 motherfuckers in here. Let's get tiny to 6K tonight. We need 80 of y'all, 302 people right now to go subscribe. 8K sub left. I don't know what you're talking about. I need six. I'm trying to get to 6K by the end of the night. And I know we could do it. I know we could do it. Mm-hmm. Smash that like button. It's definitely a hurt. Okay. That's right. Shout out Treyway uh, 6K. Free Treyway 6K. Verse. Uh, oh, yeah. So back to back to my motherfucking, uh, what you call it? Saturday. So Blue Blucks. Saturday was Blue Blucks. I seen Blue Blucks. That's when I turned uh, tuned in. I tapped in. I see Blue. Oh, you know what? I got to do my rounds, kid. It's 103. Hey. And why whenever I'm, I got I to do my rounds, kid. Mm-hmm. All right. Fuck. All right. Well, I, I'm going to talk about the Blue Blood. Blue Bloods, they cool. They not really festival to me. They all like club edition. Like, I wouldn't want to see them at a festival. Or they, I don't know if they too high, if they was too high, or what the fuck. That motherfuckers in the middle of the street going crazy. This shit, wow. Uh, uh, yeah, Blue Blucks, I don't know if Blue Blucks is over there, what you call it? You over there being nosy for sure. Uh, they, they, they got good songs, but performance-wise, they not it. I don't know if they got to get more season or if they songs just don't hit performance-wise. They probably just like car bangers or some shit like that. Cases with them. But I just know it wasn't that. Like, I wasn't, I was excited to see, oh, shit. I was excited to see uh, Blue Blucks. And then, because that was my first time ever seeing them perform. But then once I heard them, I'm like, oh, y'all niggas, basic cable. They what you call basic cable. They straight, but they ain't like, you know what I'm saying? <clears throat> uh-huh. What it say? Uh, 50 more subs. Aki said 50 more subs. Let's go. Let's get to that 6K. Let's celebrate. Let's celebrate tonight. Let's get to that 6K. Because they said the congregation was dead. They tried to say the congregation was dead. Yeah, that's crazy. They try to say y'all was dead. They just don't know that y'all are growing more and more. Shout out to this uh, green Astro hat, too. Motherfucker looks stupid. Mm-hmm. Dunking on them like I'm Blake Griffin. Bad bitch, 50 flow in hibachi. Yeah, so Blue Bloods, they were straight, but I wouldn't go spend money to go see Blue Bloods. Put it like that. I, I wouldn't go spend money to see them. I'd play that shit in the car. Fuck that. I ain't about to just go up here and you bullshitting. I need to, I need to see a performance. I'm all perform. Damn, it's crazy. It's all my, look at this shit. This this is crazy tonight. It just laid out. It's wild. Uh huh. I gotta take my picture though. Yeah, bad sitch. Fifty flow in her body. Bad sitch is funny. And I need to know the uh I need to know the, the Blue Blucks niggas names. Cause I look I look I like uh I know them all as a group. I don't know them like individually on some shit. You get your ass beat like you Ronda Rousey. Oh me. My my little brother G3 said he can't listen to Blue Blucks.
can't hear. Oh, no sound is crazy. No sound is wild. Hold on. Hold on. One more minute. It's because my, uh, nah, it's because my phone about to die. I think that's the problem. You good? I think it's because my phone about to die. And I keep trying to charge it. It's hard trying to charge it and be on it and moving around. It's good. I'm good. I got 2G. Y'all funny. Have I listened to Boss Man D-Lo new album? Nah, that's what I'm not listening to. I probably listen to some songs off the album, but I don't see myself listening to a Boss Man d album. It might be tight, though. I got to hear some songs to see if it is tight, though. Uh-huh. I asked phone still at 3%. For sure, it's still, it's still low. It's still low. I know. And you know what? Uh, who said that? Who said that? Come on, time me with this dead phone shit. Yada to me, I really have a dead phone problem. Like, my phone will die. Throughout the day, my phone died probably like two times throughout the day, minimum. But that's because I'm traumatized because one year on my birthday, I charged my phone. I turned my phone off to charge my phone, and then that motherfucker never turned back on. Like, I don't know if the battery exploded. Like, I charged it too much. I don't know what the fuck. So now I just get a little juice. Once I get a little juice, I'm gone. I'm a little juice-ass nigga. I just get the little juice, and then I'm I'm good. I'm like, my phone always 50% or lower. For sure, for sure. I can teach for this. Doorman off the new album. Okay, I listen to him. You need a portable charger, my guy. I do. I need a lot of shit. I need a lot of shit. Time to upgrade. Time to upgrade to what? The only nigga that turned his phone off while charging it. Because when you turn your phone off, that gives it, like, I don't need my shit still on activating while it's charging. That's how I don't get the maximum charge. Like, I need my shit to just charge. If I'm charging it, I don't need my phone on to be charging. Like, I just need to charge. Dunking on them like I'm Blake Griffin. Mm-hmm. I wasn't ain't on the paint, Tommy. They do charge it faster when it's all yeah. That's actually the dumbest shit I've ever heard. That's crazy, Torres. You judging me because my what's let me see here some of your logics. I bet you you got some dumbest shit I ever heard too. Logics, nigga. So that's the dumbest shit you ever heard. How is that dumbest shit you ever heard if you turn the phone off and you charge it? Shouldn't that make the phone charge faster? How is that dumb? Mm-hmm. What say tiny streets really be perfect for third shift workers? Yeah, 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 it do. It do. I feel like the people that be new that's here. Shout out to y'all. Make sure y'all go subscribe. We on the road to 6K. You know what I'm saying? Free Treyway. We on our way to 6K. Free Treyway. Tiny sensitive. Damn. All right. So look, I got a question for y'all. So if Tiny is sensitive, which is possible? I'm not saying I am. I'm not saying I'm not. But... Is it better for me to deny that I'm sensitive, playing to the narrative of being sensitive, or ignore being sensitive? I feel like if I ignore being sensitive, then that's then that's like that's nothing. If I play into that narrative, then niggas be thinking I'm for real. And then if I say I'm not sensitive, niggas be thinking I'm lying. So what should I do? Be you. That's what I do. I just be, yeah. Always getting butt hurt. Damn. That's crazy. You just want you just want your narrative heard. 
And you didn't even come up with that narrative, though. That's what's crazy. You going off another nigga narrative. Don't go off another nigga narrative. Be yourself. Tiny, one day you're going to be all made back edition. I know. Oh, that'd be tight. I still do a stream in the, oh, yeah, that's what I want to do. I want to get the Maybach so I can do the stream in the Maybach, bitch. Yeah, that's what I want to do. I want to get the Maybach so I could do a stream in the Maybach, bitch. I'm not calling nobody in here, bitch. I'm just saying that. I feel like bitch, bitch at the end of that was like, that was like the exclamation mark. Streaming in the Maybach, bitch. <laughs> oh my god! I gotta take these pictures. <clears throat> when I go home, I'm really looking for my neck tat. Oh, there it go. Y'all see that shit? I'm supposed to say something about God. <laughs> I really was looking for my shit. I'm like, where the fuck is my neck tat at, kid? Car streams are lit. They are lit. I fuck with it. If the viewers fucking with it, then I fuck with it. That neck on the milk cart is funny, bro. That neck on the milk cart, don't be. <clears throat> that neck on the milk carton. Can you just can you imagine? Cause they just be putting uh they just be putting the cow on a milk carton and shit, but it ain't really like the picture of the cow that they got that milk from. Do you think that every carton of milk should have the picture of the exact cow that they got that milk from? I think I think that's that should be uh I think they should do that. Low key. I need to see the milk. I need to see the actual cow that y'all got this milk from. Don't just show me no regular cow. Somebody drew a cow or something, a picture of a all healthy cow. You know what I'm saying? Well, hey, I ain't the president. They got other shit in the world that's going on. They ain't fucking with me. <clears throat> that's the mascot. <laughs> nah, I ain't high. I really wanted. I really just. I'm just trying to figure it out. Cause you go in the motherfucking, uh, you go in the market and shit, and then you just open. You just see the milk, the cow on the on the milk. Not knowing it was a fucked up cow that this milk came from. Then you start having your preference. Like, oh yeah, this this cow kind of thick. This shall have some good milk. <laughs> this cow kind of thick. It should have some good milk. It's crazy. This cow kind of thick. Yeah. And, uh, y'all funny. I didn't say all that. Yeah, I don't want no angry cow. Exactly. You drinking angry cow milk. You didn't even know. You wondering why your day fucked up. It's because you drunk, you ate some cereal that morning with some angry cow milk. And you didn't even know the cow was angry. That's why they need that picture of that cow on, that, on the front of the motherfucking milk carton so then you can know. Like, oh, it's a possibility it's going to fuck up your mood. But hey, that's what I'm saying. If I was president, that's the type of shit I'm trying to do. They, ain't, they don't want me to be president. They talking about TikTok bans and shit. They want to ban TikTok. That's what they trying to do. They don't want Tiny to be out here really, you know, causing havoc in these motherfucking streets. Yeah. Oh, we got a super chat too from Ron J. Shout out to you, your first super chat to me. I appreciate that. He said, all the way from PA, shout out Tiny. PA is Pennsylvania, right? Is PA Pennsylvania? How do they get PA? How do they get Pennsylvania from PA? But yeah, shout out to you. The congregation, we all, we all over the world. Shout out to you. Thank you for the super chat too. I appreciate that. Yeah. 
Cal got diabetes, high blood pressure. Oh, so you saying that they it should be having like a Carfax? It should be having that on the back of the milk carton? That's not a bad idea because think about it. You could go, you could look at the back. Oh, this cow had a healthy life. He was living good. He, he uh, produced milk. He was happy. Drink this milk with your cereal. Boom. Then you can have this, the other cow. Oh, he's angry. He had a bad life. He was stuck. Like, you need a Carfax for the for the motherfucking, uh, yeah, you need a Carfax for the motherfucking uh, cows. That's crazy. Oh, it start with a P and end with an A? Oh, is that what it is? Is that how the, uh, Minnesota? Nah, because Minnesota. Minnesota is not M-A. Minnesota not M-A. So you can't say that. A cow fax. Yeah, cow fax. That's what it is. They need a cow fax. Milk, milk that milk is funny. Milk that milk probably the funniest shit out there read that tonight. Milk that milk. Wait, wait. I was on to something right quick. What was we talking about? And we were talking about something besides the milk and the cows. Oh, yeah, the, the words, the, the city. Okay, because California is C-A, but California, I guess it end with an A. Okay. What's a, what's another uh, Arizona? Arizona is A-Z. It don't end with a Z, so it can't say it start with a P and end with an A. That's not a good answer, nigga. You try to get me. I know that's it, yeah, man. You try to get me. Sound is out, fool. Sound is out? Is my sound is out? Or they just talking about that. Yeah, Florida is FL. Yeah, what the fuck he talking about? It's the first and the last letter. Cash, you try. Cash, you. Oh, now this nigga breaking it down like he doing syllables. Arizona. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you a funny nigga, homie. West Virginia's WV. It was Pena, but for the postal code, they use PA. Okay, shout out to you. I believe you, 365 OTG. I'm listening to him. It said it was Pena, but for the postal code, they use PA. That seemed like some shit that he, uh, that he live out there, he know. Sounds out the state. Yeah, Minnesota is not M.A. I'm in Philly right now. Okay. Shout out to you in Philly right now. <clears throat> Make sure y'all like this video. Y'all subscribe. Everybody put where y'all from if y'all haven't already. Shout out to everybody in Philly that's part of the congregation. Uh, hopefully I could go to Philly. Just a high-ass convo. I'm about to twist up. Speaking of high convo, let me... Uh, I got to write my report, though. I almost fucked up. Almost fucked up. Homie with the Jerry Curl sent some chili. Shout out to you. Thank you. He said, uh, 420 about to light up one. Oh, okay. 420. That's top of the Lily over there where you at. It's Monday. It started a new week. 420. I see you. He says 420 about to spark up one and call it a night. It's a herd. You ain't about to call it a night if you about to spark up one. That's a whole nother little 15, 20 minute session. You ain't gonna call it a night right now. You are you here until it's uh 420 over there. You here till five in the morning, at least 445. If you about to twist up and smoke and listen to Tiny, you're gonna be laughing, you're gonna try to go to sleep, but then one eye gonna be open because you hear my voice. Yeah, I say 445, five o'clock for you. <clears throat> I'm new, I'm curious. Are you from back on fig or community? Do you have a background in music? How do you get your start? Shit, that's a good question. No, I'm not from uh community. I am from Fig. Uh what do you say? Do I got background in music? No, I don't have no background in music. I'm really just a just a homie that came around and seen seen niggas uh I'm a homie that, that just was around and niggas was streaming and I just got on camera and then I just kept coming back on camera. That's what that's basically what happened. Niggas are streaming. I got on camera. 
and then shit got invited back, then got invited to another show, and then got invited to another show, and then became permanent on one show, and then made my own show, and then shit, that's how I went. That's how I went. But I don't have no, no like no music ties or all that. Yeah, I'm all. I'm these just the homies. For the show, these just the homies. <clears throat> But I don't consider myself like a like a music. That's why when they be talking music on uh Mac, like when we on Apollo, they be talking music, I really just be listening, trying to learn and shit, because I'm not like a music head like that, music junkie, music like nah. You never really got invited. Yeah, no, nah, I never really got invited, cuz, but I'm here. That's how you know you don't need an invite all the time. You just gotta be around. You know what I'm saying? You don't you don't need to invite all the time. You just be around and then boom. It's just like that's why I be like, you be niggas in the NBA and shit. They be like the 12th man, 11th man, never get on the court, always where they warm ups, but they sitting on the bench like they about to get in the game and shit. You know what I'm saying? It's good to be that person. You on the roster. You at the games, you ain't on the floor, but you never know. Somebody might get hurt, and then boom, there go your time. It might be a blowout, and now you get in the game. You never know when you're gonna be able to get in the game, but you always gotta, uh, you got, you always gotta have you put yourself in position because you never know what's gonna happen. So me not never being invited, really, that's probably true. But I just put myself in position to when my number was called. You know what I'm saying? Boom. Triple double out the gate. You bitch. Uh what do you mean you feature on the album? Hey, I am on the album. I am on the album. Shout out to I'ma stack my O's like Ohio. See, that's crazy. Back to rolling loud. I feel like if Q would have performed, which he could have probably performed, but Dreamville, that's it. Like, I just can't wait to hear him perform Blue Lips, cuz. I just really can't wait for him to, what you call it? You ain't got to explain yourself. Nah, I ain't explaining myself. I'm just telling my story. Uh, you're a songwriter for Usher. I could write songs, though. Me and Drebo did a, uh, you got, it's on one of the congregation episodes. I had sent him some shit. The XO. And he he like made it tight, but I sent him like the the just cause I can't sing and he could kind of sing, but it was just uh, I love you, baby XO. Drinking on that Hennessy XO. My ex don't wanna let go. I'm trying to make it to the next level or some shit like that. Yeah, I'll post that too. I did my rounds. I gotta write my report. Damn. Uh, uh, let me write, let me write this report right quick. I'm in that lane switching, then a lane switching, mm-hmm. Dunking on him like I'm Blake Griffin. All right. <clears throat> My bad, y'all. I gotta write this, what you call it? Yeah, one take Ocho, write you something. That's funny. You want me to write you something? You want me to hit a note? Ooh, yeah. Ooh, yeah. Uh, what you ordered for lunch today, Tiny? Shit, I got my water and my Gummy skills and my scratchers for lunch. Nigga, that's my lunch. Mm-hmm. Make sure y'all uh it's on seven. Did you link with bees? What you talking about? Hey, make sure y'all so subscribe. How many more subscribers I need? Am I at 6k yet? I need to know if I'm at 6k. Sonny, that was you on Lovebirds. Uh, Cause I love her. 
I'll treat it. Back up. That's what I'm saying. I want to see that at the performance, at the crowd. I know they're going to be going stupid. Oh, yeah. So, yeah, while I'm writing it, let me go. Let me finish talking about Rolling Loud. I got my, uh, see, I'll be kind of being a little prepared for y'all. I got my little notes, you know what I'm saying? You can't see it. Yeah, I got my little notes, you know what I'm saying? Got my little notes. But yeah, uh, Blue Blucks. So yeah, Saturday when I turned on, because I forgot all about Rolling Loud again. I'll be, I don't be thinking about that shit. Then when I turned it on, Blue Blucks was on. They was basic cable. They was regular. Get your ass beat like you Ronda Rousey. Then after that, Big X the Plug. Big X the Plug. Now, who seen Big X the Plug? I never... Now, shout out to Kylan. Kylan, you know, kids be remembering everything. And Kylan told me, he like, that's the one that walked out with Spence when Spence fought uh, Crawford. Crawford walked out with Eminem. He walked out with Cud from Texas. Big ass nigga. I'm from Texas. Cud took his shirt off and all that during his performance. He did it up. I ain't gonna lie. He did it up. But I don't like Cud because I feel like he gave Spence some weed before the fight, bruh. I know he bought some weed. That big nigga got that. He can't, that big ass nigga can't smoke no regular weed. He gotta smoke that. That shit that sit you down. That's a big ass nigga. So, yeah, Big X the plug. That's a big-ass nigga. So he got the gas. And, you know, Spence, like, let me hit that. His nerves is bad and shit. He about to fight and shit. He trying to calm down. Spence, like, oh, police coming? I don't know if police going. They, they engine went crazy. But, yeah. Nah, I feel like he like he had some two like he had talking about power pack, smoke that smoke. He had that power pack for Spence ass, homie. So Spence nerves all bad. Then in the back, he got he big bud. You know what I'm saying? He like, let me hit that. I'ma say big plug said, Are you sure? This that shit. You know what I'm saying? I, I think Big Plug gave him the motherfucking uh, I think Big Plug gave him the like a warning, like don't hit this, like this, like I, I really smoke, bruh. You know, Spence, whenever niggas, you know, I'm a smoke dog, baby. I've been smoking since I was two. He all the smoky edition. <laughs> so boom. Spence hit the weed. He <coughs> <coughs> he try to act like he cool, but that nigga never was the same after that. He come watch when Spence walk out. I'm telling you. Look at Earl Spence's face when he walk out with the nigga Big X plug. Well, I'm from Texas. That's all I remember the nigga came out talking about, I'm from Texas. And I looked at Spence's eyes and cuz shaded. I know. I smoke. I know when the nigga smoke, when the nigga high. And Spence was high. He hit too. All right. Not too much on Spence, because I fuck with Spence. Spence the nigga. I fuck with Spence. He, he... <laughs> that nigga almost whooped the fan out of him. Like, I almost... Became not a fan how bad he got whooped. But yeah. But yeah, shout out to him though. I didn't even know that was him. Kylan had to put me up on game that that was him. Big X the plug. Now rapping, that nigga do his shit. Like I said, he took his shirt off. That nigga confident. He he yeah, he rapping, he doing his shit. He he definitely, he definitely had a great performance. He definitely had a great performance. Hold on, I gotta write this shit. Damn. All right. Smoking near. Uh, uh, there. Okay, smoking near the parking garage. Uh, my bad, y'all. He was informed. He couldn't. Sit right there and left immediately. All uh, right. Boom. Well, I'm from Texas. The nitty really, really, really. Spence, 
Spence was, man, Spence was blazed and he got blazed. That's what I'm saying. Crawford almost whooped the fan out. I'm like, I don't even want to be a fan of a nigga that got whooped like this, kid. Spence couldn't hear for a week after that fight. I bet he couldn't. That nigga had to. I know he just wanted to go home and go to bed. He just wanted to go home and go to bed. Um. So so yeah, but shout out to to Big X the plug though. He he for sure. I like his performance. He gonna get lit. I don't know his songs, but that don't matter. I look at. I look at performance. If you got the stage lit, if I fuck with the song, how you, if you rapping your lyrics or if you letting the song just play, it's a lot of shit that I look at or I go to uh, while somebody performing. And he's definitely a, a good performer. He had the crowd going. Uh, he put on for Texas. I didn't know that was a, that's a big ass nigga. Girl. I just didn't know he was the big ass nigga like that. I was like, who the fuck is this? And the guy that walks Spence out. I'm like, is it? This nigga got spins high. I'm from Texas. Hmm. Big X. Nah, Tiger and YG. Hell nah. That's a bar, Chase. 40 more to 6K. That's right. We need 40 more subscribers. We got 301 people in here. I know all 301 of y'all not subscribed. We on the road to 6K. We trying to get 6K. So I just need y'all to go subscribe. If you're not subscribed, and if you are subscribed, then thank you. I appreciate it. But we need, we trying to get to 6K. We trying to get to 6K. Tonight. Tonight. We are young. Set this world on fire. Oh, shit. Damn, but this 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 dark this this car kind of cold uh not cold but we almost there yeah we I'm glad that you said we because it is a we thing it's not an I I'm not almost there we almost there we doing this shit together stick to your night job who your top three out of scene uh, I give you that after I uh keep going so yeah after that after i seen him i seen larry june larry june man i ain't gonna lie basic cable i guess he just i probably don't know a lot of his songs like that but he don't got he chill he like a chill uh he like a chill rapper he like a chill. He ain't he ain't got a lot of energy. His songs don't got a lot of energy. He like one of those type of rappers. So Larry June, I fuck with his songs and shit, but seeing paying money to see him at a festival, I'm cool. I'm cool. No disrespect to Larry June. Shout out to you. Orange is in the chat for Larry June. But uh performance wise, festival wise, it was it was basic cable. But I did like that 91, 91, 91. He performed that. I didn't know he performed that. Have you ever been so fly that you see? We want to take you home to a G. We say, bitch, I feel amazing. Eh, eh, eh. Yeah, he too cool, though. He too cool. He don't get the crowd. Uh, He don't get the crowd going. Bitch, I feel like a demon. 91, 91, 91. Larry June, a good date concert, not festival. Yeah, like I see him intimate. Pause. But I'd rather see him like, I'd rather just see him with 200 people type shit. Or however many. A venue. Let me see him at a venue. I ain't got to see him at no fucking festival. That's what I'm not looking forward to seeing. But I'm not. I'm. I'm a. Uh, I'm a Larry June fan though. No, I ain't no Larry June fan. I take that back. I, he ain't weak. I, I ain't saying Larry June weak. Okay, let's say that. <clears throat> Tiny, why I look like I'm watching a short today? I don't know. Why I look like you watching a short today? You tell me, man. <clears throat> okay. 
Then after uh after Larry June, who who I seen? Where my phone at? I'm trying to trying to twist this gas up. Where my other phone at? Oh I can't find my other phone yet. I don't know what I did with my other phone. Because it's vertical, okay. Yeah, yeah. When I do when I go sideways, uh, I can't see the chat and shit. I'm not on the computer. I'm not on the uh what's that shit called? A iPad. Bitch, I feel amazing. Eh, eh, eh. Let me see. Let me smoke that smoke. Yeah, smoke that smoke, drink that drink. Trying to smoke that smoke. Did everybody have a good St. Patrick's Day? Do people be even going out for St. Patrick's Day? Ain't you supposed to drink beer or some shit? Ain't you supposed to drink beer today? What the fuck is St. Patrick's Day? Who know what St. Patrick's Day is? Let's learn. Let's learn. Somebody teach me right now. Because I know about the, the leprechauns and shit. I feel like that's like how they did with Easter with the Easter bunny. Like, it don't really got nothing to do with it. But they just going to make it have something to do with it. So, do it got something to do with it? Do leprechauns got something to do with motherfucking uh, St. Patrick's Day? Let me know. I know it's for the Irish. I know that. But I'm saying, what is it? Like Irish Independence Day or something? What is like what is it? What what it do with the Irish? I probably learned this or know this answer already. Uh, he removed the snakes out of Ireland. The hell are you talking about? Conor McGregor B Day. Who the fuck is that guy? I always laugh when Duno say that because he he got that from uh Conor McGregor. Who the fuck is that guy? He served that nigga. Lucky Charms B Day. These narratives is crazy. That's what I said. Nobody know. Nobody know. They just this shit is just on the map. I, that's what I'm saying. Even though I always be talking about dates and times and shit, we gotta come up. When was the? What's the newest or the? the yeah, what's the newest motherfucking holiday? Like, how do you? Even though this is not really a holiday, but it is on the calendar, kind of. Like, what's the newest holiday they didn't fucking grandfathered in or whatever? Like, I don't even remember seeing them fucking holidays. All these holidays been around. They just do bullshit like... Now, now they do bullshit like National, uh, National Sunday. Now I see shit like that. I didn't used to see shit like that. Like, when the fuck did March 18th become National Take a Shower with your clothes on day? Because they be having all type of weird shit going on. Yeah, everybody take a shower with your clothes on today. National Girlfriend Day, Juneteenth. Juneteenth? Uh, I guess. GPS month? God damn. GPS month is crazy. Uh, National Steak and BJ Day going up. <laughs> yeah, what, what day is that? Did that day pass? I missed it. If it passed, we got to double back. They gave Black Folks Juneteenth. Okay, all right. So Juneteenth was the the damn. 
it's the this that's fucked up that this lighter gonna do me like this on the way on I gotta go get another lighter, bro. This shit worked and then it, it looked like it's done now. Patrick O'Neill National Harassment. This shit crazy. Black people been celebrating June 16th. That's what I'm saying. I don't even see how that's a fucking, uh, damn, Gina. It's over, Tiny. All right, I got to go back to the store. Shout out to y'all. We'll be tuned in. Watching me all night. Getting y'all through y'all shares. Uh, I'm funny. Cash, I'm crazy. I don't even... Damn, cash only. I spent my 10. I got my 10. Damn, that's crazy. That's just say cash only on the door. So I'm going to have to go to the other spot. This nigga saying cash only so he can fucking pocket some shit. I already know what he doing. That's the oldest trick in the book. Talking about cash only. He looked like he pocketing some shit in there. Look at this shit. You can't even see this nigga. Look at that nigga. Oh, uh, you can't even see him. But look at that shit. Cash only. We have firewood. You can't even see that nigga. He over there. He doing some scam shit. I right, fuck 7-Eleven. Shit crazy. I'm going to go to another 7-Eleven. They don't even worry about me. I'm tripping. Do you know Kane? No, I don't know Kane. Oh, we got a super chat from uh, It's Aki. He said, uh, we passing the plate for 6K. Only need 30 subs, mods, and chats. Where y'all at? That's right. We only need 30 more for 6K. We moving quick. I look at my analytics when you start when you saying DoorDash. I mean not DoorDash, but dashboard. When you start saying dashboard is crazy. Look, wait, before before I get into that, look at how much gas is though. Before I get into dashboards and shit. Oh, you switch this motherfucker. Well that shit uh, look at that shit. That motherfucker. God damn. 529, 509. This shit crazy. Yeah. But yeah, so looking uh so looking at fucking what you call it, but looking at my uh dashboard, bruh. I've been everything plus, everything up plus. Like, we growing. We doing what, we not down, negative. Like, we trending up. We trending up. That's the that's the tightest thing about it all. We trending up, bro. There go that bogus ass bus. Hold up before you catch it. <laughs> 505 for your gas. Damn. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. LA will make you cry. LA will make you cry. Hello. I just hopped out the car. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. I need a lighter. Yeah. Yeah. I 
262. Damn. 262. Oh, God. 262 for a lighter. That's what I'm saying. $5 for gas, 262 for a lighter. Good luck. Let me get the receipt. All right. Have a good one. Yeah. You got the munchies now. 262 to get the flame, bro. That that no lighter cost me a trip and 262, which is $3. Let me round that motherfucker up. That's crazy. So all type of shit going on. 371 for some gas in Chicago. That's a hundred dollar stop playing with me, Smokey. <laughs> yeah, 262 for a lighter, kid. That's what I'm saying. Everything in LA is just high. Me 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 just looking is just high, kid. That's why I don't even be trying to keep up with the Joneses. Or the Kardashians or where the fuck things be trying to keep up with. I'll be in my own lane. Mm -hmm. Dunking on them like I'm Blake Griffin. Appreciate everybody tuning in to this motherfucker. Like the video. For sure, for sure, like the video. I'm mad that I didn't even get to put on Instagram. You know what? It's all right. I ain't got to put on Instagram. Because I'm here with YouTube. They should have their motherfucking notifications on, right? Motherfucker. So how y'all liking these Sundays? These Sundays, uh, where the other phone at? I gotta look for the other phone. That's where my notes is at. Damn. There's all type of shit going on. Mm-hmm. But how y'all like these, uh, Sundays, uh, Thursday night, Sunday night streams? Let me know. I know motherfuckers be seeing what I'm doing and they, you know, be be on the lookout for other late night streams. You know what I'm saying? It's a it's a wide open field. Be on the lookout. It works for me. It's my Friday. It's my Friday too. That's the cold part. It's my Friday and I'm going into Thursday. Excuse me. It's definitely my Friday. They were trying to call me to come in during the week. I mean, I would since we ain't doing Apollo right now, but for the most part, I'm cool on that. I don't be like, like, I'm a good worker, but I ain't no extra worker type shit. Like, nigga, because y'all motherfuckers try to use me to the dirt all the way to I can't be used no more. Then y'all just replace me. Once I'm, y'all feel like I ain't uh, usable no more. So fuck all that shit. Get that OT, hell no. Get that OT. I remember I was working for FedEx. OT was mandatory around Christmas time. You think your ass about to go home, nigga, shit. Damn, man, sit your ass down. I'm on PTO till Thursday. That's right. Do your shit. Do your shit. Hold on. I'm trying to set this up. Hold on right quick, y'all. Hold on. I'm trying to look for the other phone. Damn. 
I just had the other phone. I was showing notes. But. My bad. I really don't know where the other phone went that quick. Uh, King Nick sent some shitty shout out to you. Nobody understands the umbrella. Fuck with Geechee Gotti. What about Daylight? I know he tied in with D, uh, TDE. Um, nobody understands the umbrella. Nobody understands it. That's because it, it ain't really no umbrella. The umbrella is just a... Uh, Ain't no umbrella, man. <laughs> That's just a goddamn bottom line. Ain't no umbrella. Oh, here it go. Got it. You view me. All right. Yeah, ain't no umbrella, though. As you know, it's just shit. Like I said, we need to go back to the tree. We need to grow. We got to grow. We need to grow. Damn that umbrella. Ever since niggas been bringing up the umbrella, shit been going downhill. Some niggas ain't part of the umbrella. Some niggas want to be part of the umbrella. Some niggas, they don't want a part of the umbrella. Some niggas don't want to be part of the umbrella. This shit weird. That's why I just got to... Shout out to the congregation. And then the rest, we going to figure it out. I fuck with the homies, though. And uh, Geechee Gotti, uh, I see him doing a little rap shit, rap battles and shit. And Daylight, yeah, I, I went to the uh, studio. <clears throat> he was in there rapping and shit. Uh, I don't know them personally, but, yeah, I know who they are. I know who they are. Uh, mm hmm Thank you for the super chat, though, for sure, for sure. It said message got deleted by a congregation. What somebody sent the what? What does that? What happened? They sent the super chat. It was disrespectful. That's crazy. I don't know what that's about. They like crazy as fuck. Yeah, anybody with tats on their face and all that, they crazy as fuck. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay, so I found the phone, though. I stopped the Rolling Loud combo because I, 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 I forgot I was looking for my phone. So, yeah, I think I left off at Larry June. Like I said, basic cable. Shout out to Larry June. I see you at a venue, but I don't want to see you at no festival, my nigga. You too cool. Your songs is too chill. It ain't like, it ain't festival. It ain't festival music. It ain't festival music. Uh, After Larry June, it was Big Sean. Now, Big Sean was a vet. Big shout out. First shout out to Big Sean because they said he... He had some type of food poison or some some I don't know if it was food poison or whatever it was. He said he lost 15 pounds that last week, last week. And he still, they told him not to perform there. And he still said, fuck that. I'm about to perform. I'm about to do rolling out. So shout out to him for still even performing. But uh yeah, he had the band. He didn't have, he wasn't performing over his vocals too much. Like you could hear his vocals in the background, but you, it ain't like just a song playing and him rapping ad libs and shit. Like you could tell that he was rapping. And uh, I don't fuck with you, little stupid ass bitch. That shit went up. Like I, I like that. Like he had a good performance. Big Sean was, you could, like I said, you could tell. That's when the name started getting bigger on the, on the motherfucking flyer. You know what I'm saying? But Big Sean did his thing. I fuck with Big Sean. He had one of the uh he had one of the best uh performances on Saturday that I saw. I ain't gonna lie to you. Shout out Big Sean. <clears throat> I 
I was on I was on the Big Sean wave too when he first came out. He he like whatever though. I I fell off. I ain't no like Big Sean fan like that no more. But I ain't like he ain't weak to me either. On me, then uh. Yeah, Post Malone. That's crazy. I miss Post Malone too. So I miss Nikki and I miss Post Malone. That's crazy. So I miss both of the headliners. I miss Friday Night Headliner and I miss Saturday Night Headliner. Post Malone got a lot of songs that you be like, damn, that's a Post Malone song. That's a Post Malone song. I see like the highlights and shit. I think he bought Quavo out, if I'm not mistaken. Like he, uh, I know people be saying he used the black. He, he act like he was black, and then now he with the white people or some shit like that. I ain't tripping off. I ain't tripping off that. Cause I guess because I ain't in the music like that, so I don't know. I can't say what he did or what he didn't do. But for him to headline Co- uh, Coachella, for him to headline Rolling Loud, uh, that's good shit. Like, I am going to go back and watch his performance because from the highlights, it looked like he had a good performance. Did anybody see him? Post was out there barefoot. Yeah, nigga performed barefoot. That's crazy. Uh, Jetty Music, where King, nigga, I don't know, it's two in the morning. I don't know where the hell King at. <clears throat> the kid Frankie. Who was that? Uh, Wiz Khalifa? Yeah, yeah, he headlined on Saturday. But shout out to uh, Post Malone. I am gonna go back and watch. Cause I'm he he a good performer. I have seen Post Malone perform before, not not in person, but I have seen him like at uh, I want to say was it like Dreamville or some shit. I seen him at one. It was probably Rolling Loud Miami or some shit. I seen him performing before, so I I know he got good stage presence and he a good performer. But I just missed him at, at this Rolling Loud. <clears throat> Did anybody see him? Did. Did anybody come out? What happened to the Apollo stream? Oh no. Did anybody come out besides Quavo? Any Northern Cal rapper? <clears throat> Wiz was there. Why y'all keep talking about Wiz? Wiz came out. Yeah, that song with him and Sway Lee. Yeah, Sway Lee uh, performed that. That's funny, cause I I did he so at least should have just waited and just came out on uh post Malone set and performed that song. But Sway Lee like shit, I'm about to perform this song on my set. Shame on you. But why are we talking about uh what's up, Z? This nigga Z up in this motherfucker. But what I wanna know is why can't uh Damn, what was what was he talking about? Oh, why are we talking about Wiz? What happened with Wiz? Isaiah said, do you have a podcast and is there an upload schedule? No, I don't have a podcast. I stream from my car. I guess I do IRLs or whatever. I do IRLs. Uh... I pod with Apollo. I guess we pod. We stream slash pod. But yeah, just subscribe, like up, do you know, get updated. Get updated for sure. Why are we talking about Wiz? Did Wiz come out during uh post Malone performance? Where did Wiz come at? Like I didn't see Wiz. <laughs> get to the Sunday run. I'm about to get to Sunday. After Saturday and Sunday, I ain't, I wasn't in the restroom or something, but I kept seeing Wiz. Wiz threw me off. Shout out Post Malone, though. Saturday, I'll say the big winner Saturday will be uh, Big Sean. i say Big Sean was the big winner Saturday. But that was my favorite performer Saturday with Big Sean. Now, Sunday, you know what I'm saying? Today, we seen... Wiz got a song with Post Malone. I don't know. I was talking about Post Malone and then Wiz just in the chat. But I can't. I got to stay with what I'm talking about because I don't know what y'all talking about with Wiz. But uh, Sunday, I started off with my nigga Jason Cash. Shout out to Jason Cash, man. I seen you perform at Rolling Out. I don't know if this was your first Rolling Out. 
that you performed at or what. But I just like how you had the, the crowd yelling Carson. That's tight to me. That's, that reminds me when Kid uh, when Kid when QB having the crowds yell fig side and they say fig side like you got the whole crowd saying fig side you got the whole crowd saying Charles uh, Charson Carson that's tight you had a good performance I think you did like two or three songs on some shit uh it was tight it was tight you had K boy you saying you had K boy come out there crib walk shout out K boy on some shit uh yeah Jason. Jason Cash, he, he had a good he had a good performance. He definitely had a good performance. After Jason Cash, uh, I had tuned into Mexican OT. Now Mexican OT, I wasn't up. I only went to Mexican OT because I seen him on Back on Fig twice. Like I was, I ain't never heard Mexican OT music. I ain't updated on Mexican OT, but that nigga Mexican OT is a performer. That nigga Mexican OT get the crowd going. He got some stangers like that. Like I, that he got festival music. He got shit to go. I fuck with Mexican OT. That was my first time really ever listening to him. I didn't know what songs he was performing because I don't know any of his songs. But I definitely enjoyed Mexican OT. Mexican OT, he for sure was, he did his shit. He did his shit. I, I liked his performance. I like this before. He he country. I think it's the country voice and how he I think he uh Mexican or whatever. And he's like, you don't really see, well, I don't really see too many country Mexican like black. Cause he's still kind of like black. Like he ghetto, I guess. Or country. Whatever the fuck. Like I fuck with Mexican OT. I ain't gonna lie. He had a he had a good set. Uh, again, I can't tell you none of his songs or nothing because I, I, this was literally my first time ever hearing his music. And I went to him because I'm like, oh, he on back on fig and shit. Let me see what he got. And that nigga up there, he all like hustle and flow, but he Mexican. He Mexican hustle and flow. He like a Mexican hustle and flow. And I don't mean that like, you know, uh, it's just because his voice is country, like when he talk. But I, I just got hustle and flow, but like Mexican version. As black people, we gotta stop letting everybody be black. <laughs> no, I'm not saying that he is black. I'm just saying he remind me that he he remind me of black people. Like he remind me that he, yeah. I ain't saying that he is black though. He just gave me, he just gave me like he grew up around black people vibes type shit. Yeah. Nah, but that that was a good. That was a. I fuck with. I fuck with his uh performance though. That was my first time ever seeing him. That's some shit. Like he did better than Larry June, and people. I'm sure a lot of people would pick Larry June over Mexican OT. But Rolling Loud, I've watched a Mexican OT set over. I watch a Larry June set. If they both on stage, I'm gonna go see Mexican OT, and I don't know not one of that nigga songs. <clears throat> Mm. K Watts, shout out to K Watts. She said, Mexican OT daddy definitely been to Chocolate City. That's why. Yeah, okay. All right. It's a her. Shout out to you. Finally catching late night stream. That's right. That's right. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Don't disrespect Larry Jones. That's not disrespect Larry Jones. I'm not disrespecting Larry June. That's what I said. A lot of people going to pick Larry June over uh, Mexican OT. If I'm in a car who I'm going to bump, I'm going to probably most likely bump Larry June over Mexican OT. If I was going to uh, uh, a show at a venue or something, I'll probably go to Larry June show over Mexican OT. But that festival, Rolling Loud yesterday, I'm going with Mexican OT over Larry June. For sure, for sure. <clears throat> yeah, yeah, yeah. I ain't mad that they pushing them. But then after Mexican o OT, my boy, I ain't never seen him perform either. Oh, three. My nigga Greedo perform. Hit these walkers with balls. 
All that new song is these hard and it gave me these cars and it ain't in these stars. My mama made me a star. Hey, that nigga, uh, oh, three got some hits. Oh, three got some hits and he don't even, he like, uh, he got all, I got like melody. He like all melody hits, but it still go up at a festival. Like he don't, he ain't have all that energy where he jumping across the the stage and all that. And his songs is kind of like chill, but he still got that. I don't know. He still know how to perform. He still, it was tight for the crowd. I'm from Gray Street, where we G slide. Hey, sweet Shay Shay, could you be mine? That shit, man. You know I like them dark skin like Shay Shay. That nigga said they gonna have to turn off my mic. That's all I like. Niggas just performing. He like, shit, this is my hometown. Shit. Y'all saying I gotta leave? Hell no, I'm doing two more songs or turn off my motherfucking mic. But yeah, all three had a hell of a performance. I fuck with all three performance. Yeah, yeah. I like all three old shit more than his new shit. But his new he he still, I still like the harmonizing and, and shit though. That was my first time ever seeing uh oh three live. Well, not live, but perform on stage. And we really got to put some respect on O3 name because O3 and RJ really was the first motherfuckers to start this versus shit. When they was having a little battle and shit, they had they they was at the observatory, I believe, in Santa Ana, and they both went hit for hit, song for song on stage before before verses was even a thing. They had their own little verses. So I want to give him a shout out. I feel like he birthed that and ain't nobody really going to give him his credit for that. But I ain't seen nobody do that before him. I'm from Gray Street, where we G-slot. Sweet Shay Shay, could you be my... That shit bang. So yeah, I like uh, O3. O3, had, he, he had a great performance. I'll go see O3 perform. He just got to do more of his old shit. I'm not updated with his new shit, or I ain't really too much of a fan like that of his new shit. I ain't heard nothing that's like slap like the old shit yet. I ain't heard nothing that slap like the old shit yet. Yeah. So, yeah, shout out to Greedo. He had a great performance. Uh, after Greedo, I saw Chief Keith. Oh, yeah, speaking of that. This is what we, the DJ, I want to talk to the DJs right quick. DJs, y'all got to get better when it's like venues and shit like that, festivals. Y'all got to get better with y'all set lit, like the songs y'all play before the artists come out. Because for sure we going to hear, if I rules and crips, oh, I got alone, they probably got me down by the end of the song. Seem like the whole city going against me. Every time I'm in the streets, I hear yak, yak, yak. They play that. Like, you going to hear that from the DJ before the artists come out, when the DJ trying to get the crowd hype. Like, it seemed like they all got the same songs. They was all playing Chief Keef. They was all playing uh, Kendrick. They was all playing, uh, uh, if you're a bad bitch, fuck it up, left, do it, right, do it. Like, they all playing the same they all playing the same songs. So I need my DJs to come with some new shit, like some new, some, don't be the same. Don't be the same. And don't play artists that's supposed to perform later that night. I don't know if that's like a, uh, I don't know if that's a thing or if it's a courtesy thing, like niggas playing Future and Future is supposed to be headlining, but you playing Future when you coming out, like that shit kind of tea. So I need my DJs to get better. I definitely need my DJs to get better. But back to Chief Keef, though. Uh, Chief Keef, he had a, he had a crazy performance. Chief Keef, he uh, he brought Sexy Red out. Sexy Red did her shit again. But Chief Keef, he he one of them motherfuckers that is like a, a new wave. It's like a new wave. He just got the crowd. He got the crowd going crazy. Like, he like a... He not like Playboy Cardi, cause they like a different, they in different lanes. Like I feel like fan wise, they in different lane fan wise. But to get the crowd hype like that, I think he definitely get the crowd hype. 
For sure, for sure. As long as they not playing Nas like DJ SB. That's funny. That's funny, bro. Keep chain music. Yeah, Keith. Yeah, he he for sure got you could tell, you could tell he stamped and he got his fans. Cause that was my first time seeing Chief Keith perform too. And he definitely loves so sir. That shit. Damn. Fucking with the old boys. You gonna get fucked over. Rari's and Rovers. Yeah, he, he did his shit. He did his shit. I like I like uh Sexy Red coming out though. She did her, she she performed her. She got a new song that's like she like in the army or some shit. That shit, that shit go crazy. Uh boom, 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 boom. It's something with bouncing. Boom, 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 boom. Go sexy, boom, 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 boom. Something like that. I'll be knowing songs off the beat. Like I'll be listening to beats and shit. But it's something like that. Boom, 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 boom. Boom. Yeah, whatever uh, song Sexy Red got right there, she did her shit. For sure, for sure. Shout out Sexy Red. Did a double back. She performed Friday, then she performed Sunday. I mean, she performed Saturday, and then she performed Sunday. Chief Keep. Now, let me tell you who I'm a fan of now. After Chief Keep, it was Don Tolliver. I think that's his name. Don Tolliver, bruh, I'm a fan. I would literally spend money to go see Don Tolliver perform. Cause I don't even know. I only knew like I knew Lemonade, Dirty Dirty Trippin', Da Da Da, All the Guy Be Trippin', Hey, Lemonade when I was trippin', some shit like that. Uh, Lemonade when I was trippin', You know. know. I don't know. I don't know the lyrics, but that song, that song, bruh, Don Don Tolliver, cut tight, cut tight. He performed the same song three times. That's how tight he is. That song was going up. That shit was going up. He performed three. He performed the same song three times, bruh. That's how you know his shit went up. Then after that, he had uh. After that, uh, Diddy brought Yak out. He brought Kodak out. Say you be my killer, you be my killer. Ain't nobody to play with you, my nigga. Yeah, we could be superstars. He brought Yak out. He had, it felt like he, if y'all watch that on YouTube, it seemed like he had Yak up there. Uh, like he kidnapped Yak. Like Yak didn't really want to be there, but he like kind of forced him to be there. And then Yak was like, fuck it, I'm here. But Yak was trying to leave. He like, nah, stay on stage, cuz. Then he performed again. Then he brought Travis Scott out. I'm like, damn, now Tolliver got some juice to bring Travis Scott out. Like, that's tight. Like, I didn't, I didn't know about Don Tolliver like that. Yeah, Don Tolliver, I'm a fan of him now. I ain't gonna lie. He know how to perform his shit. His shit is like, he got performing music. He got performing music. I can't, like I said, I can only probably tell you two of his songs. But go watch. Just go watch his performance. Just go watch his Rolling Loud performance. You're going to be like, oh, this nigga went up there was going stupid. Oh, that's Travis Artist. Oh, I didn't know that. Okay. That's what made, that's what made, that's what makes sense. I'm like, why the fuck would Travis Scott come out with her? In my mind, I was thinking that. But now if that's his artist, that's tight. He is Cactus Boys. Okay, I'm not, I wasn't, I'm not updated with that nigga. Don Tolliver, like I said, I, I hear his songs on the radio and shit, but I ain't, uh, I ain't updated to the point where I know, like, that's Don Tolliver. I kept, I was calling that nigga Bryson Tiller. I was T. I was playing a game on 2K, and the nigga was like, who's that performer? I'm like, I think Bryson Tiller, but I thought Bryson Tiller was a singer. <laughs> I'm out of pocket. I called Don Tolliver Bryson Tiller, kid. That's T. I told you I'd be like 80% right. I was right with the last name start with a T. Yeah. Jack boy. My nigga Yak, yeah. 
Yak, one of my... he. I don't like Yak performance. That's when I like... I like Yak music, but I wouldn't pay... F- I got to see Yak at a club. I'm not seeing Yak at no festival. Yak at a festival is weak. He don't perform. He, he, I mean, he do his dances a little bit, but I like niggas that actually perform. Like, he not performing. He just... He just let the shit play and then he say a couple of words. So I ain't, I ain't, uh, yeah, shout out to Yak. You know what I'm saying? I still fuck with his music, but performance wise, once I seen him on one of them Rolling Louds, I think it was Rolling Loud Miami. And then when it was like, get him, Yak, go to him, Yak, get him, Yak, when he did that shit, uh, that was cool, but. The performance is trash. Like, I don't like trash performances. Like, to me, that's like, that make me like you as an artist more. It's like performances, like, if you could perform. Me seeing you perform on stage. Not just, like, your song, but let me see you perform on stage. Party Next Door. I miss Party Next Door. I didn't see Party Next Door. I know that was on the flyer, but I miss Party Next Door. I miss Party Next Door. Prayers up to yet. Yeah, he looked like he was straight though. Shout out to that nigga though. But yeah, Don Tolliver, I I encourage everybody to go look at his performance. I encourage everybody to go look at his uh Rolling Loud performance. It was I give it a, a A A plus. For sure, for sure. That was his best performance. Okay, that was a good for performance for me to fall in on. Cause that nigga did his shit. <sighs> yeah, well, I feel like some niggas be just rapping too fast and too much to do it live. Like, I feel like it's easier, not easier. Well, pro- yeah, it's easier to do it in the booth because if you fuck up, you could do it again. You could punch in while you're recording. You ain't got to really say it all the way through type shit. When you perform it live, you like I feel like you and they're just rapping. He got so many songs, nigga rapping so much. It's like, God damn. Yeah, um, party down the street is coming. Yeah, I didn't see him. I didn't see him. Uh, did you see AD performance? Let's get to that. Yeah, I seen perform. Can we talk for a minute? Girl, I want to know your name. Yeah. I seen AD do a shit. Nigga was spamming. Yeah, if he's spamming, I don't know what he's talking about. Tiny All Third Shift Edition. Yes, I am All Third Shift Edition. Shout out to y'all. You know what I'm saying? On the East Coast, it is top of the lily over there. It's what, 520 on the East Coast. Well, over here as West Coast, you know me. I don't uh say it's the next day until 4 a.m. So right now, we still Sunday night. It's 221 Sunday night. I'm over here. It's my Friday night. We over here smoking that smoke, talking that talk. You know what I'm saying? My good congregation people, we needed like 30 more subscribers to get to 6K. I hope I'm closer than 30 more. I need 30 more subscribers. If you're not subscribed yet, please go subscribe right now and help me get to my 6K goal because I want to get 6K before I get off this motherfucker tonight. Um, We rocking. We rocking. We definitely rocking. 521 and VA. That's right. It's a herd. Top of the lily. 421. That is top of the lily over there, y'all to me, in Shy town Cold pizza. Wake up early in the morning, eat that pussy like cold pizza. You know what I'm saying? On the way to work, smoking that smoke. That's right, Tune Chiefa. I appreciate you tuning in to me. 221 in Seattle, Jared. Now, nah, we still we still Sunday night. We late night. We late night. We, we booty call hours. We booty call hours. Booty call hours is Approach uh, is about to come to an end, though. Uh, it said, I sent some chili on your cash app game. I got a care package for you. I grow the best tree in the city. 
shot uh, DM me, Andrew. That's what I said I was looking for. That's crazy. If you was here the last episode, I was telling King that's what I'm looking for. Somebody that like got the pack. So yeah, DM me. You said you uh cashed at me. I can't check my cash app right now because I don't want to turn off the fucking live. I don't know if it's gonna end it. But if you cashed at me, for sure, I, that's the cash app down there pin. Uh DM me for sure, for sure. Let's get the 6K. How many more I need to get the 6K? We on a 6K countdown. We on a 6K countdown, you know what I'm saying? Time to get the 6K. I got to come to L.A. and go down feed before I leave Earth, man. All you got to do is just play GTA and then go down like where the hoes be on GTA. And then that's like fit. I hit King last time. He stopped replying. Oh, uh, okay. That's King. I ain't going to stop replying. Unless it's like, he probably, I don't know if he got lost in sauce or it probably didn't sound right. Something didn't sound right with you. I don't know. Yeah, hit my DM, Andrew, for sure, for sure. Definitely. Especially if you're in the city. I need people in the city. I need motherfuckers in the city to work. Because what I really want to do, I want to do a skit at work or something. But I need somebody to film it. Unless I, I can't film myself, right? Yeah, I I need, I got to hit up Trevor. Trevor, where you at, man? I know you do a day in the life and shit. Let's do pause, a night in the life. <laughs> yeah, let's do a night in the life, Trevor. Oh, man. Uh, I'm getting ready for work. Listening, listening. Yeah, it's a heard radio. Shout out to the philosopher. You know what I'm saying? Cause I'm getting high and I feel like I could philosophize. <laughs> yeah, I feel like I'm philosophizing. Oh man. But yeah, shout out Don Tolliver. Then after Don Tolliver, to end the night, we have future. Future, bruh. Well, with Don Tolliver, it's crazy though, because when Don Tolliver was out out there, and then he did the song with Travis Scott, the the crowd went crazy. This crowd kept saying "yeet, yeet." The crowd kept saying "yeet," and Travis Scott left. I'm like, Kev, Travis Scott, because Don Tolliver already had a hell of a performance. Like, is he already got the crowd there? So I'm like, if this niggas do yeet, I I see why. Somebody, you feel me, might pass out. I will see why somebody might pass out. Being in there, if he would have did yeet at that moment, oh, my God. I don't think somebody would have made it. Somebody wouldn't have made it. But the crowd was chanting yeet. He just walked off stage, and he didn't do it. So then Future performed, and nigga Travis Scott came back out again. And this time he performed Yeet. And that nigga tried, when you talk about energy on stage, first off, it was one rolling out where the nigga tore his ACL on stage. He fell and tore his ACL and he still performed. Like, that nigga Travis Scott, when you talking about performing, I seen Travis Scott perform live before uh, the damn concert. He went before Kendrick, because Kendrick, you know, Kendrick toured, but Travis Scott went before Kendrick. And Travis Scott, he had a whole, he had a big ass bird that used to fly over the, uh, like in the venue, he was performing on top of the bird. Like he was performing on top of the bird. But, uh, that's deep like candy cane. Pop it, but a life I cannot change. In the hills, deep like candy cane. That song, that's when he performed that song. Pop it, pop it, in the hills. But uh, yeah, he came. He performed Yeet, and that shit, that shit was crazy. Future did his shit. Don't get me wrong. Future had a hell of a performance. Future and uh, Metro Boomin, they had a great performance. But Yeet, Yeet was the song. Like they had the fire going. The shit, like when they show the air view, it's nighttime. They show the air view of the crowd. That shit just looked tight. That shit just look fun and tight. Go watch that shit. If you ain't seen that shit, go watch that shit. Roll it loud. Go watch uh, Don Tolliver and then go watch Future. 
on some shit. <clears throat> and when Travis Scott come out, it, that shit don't make no motherfucking sense. Oh yeah, shout out to uh Duno too. I seen Duno, I was watching him on YouTube. Uh he was sitting at the desk and shit. That was tight. That was tight. I could see the Apollo doing something like that. Keem said he was gonna do that for us, but then Mac left, so we couldn't even do it. But I could see Apollo doing something like that. That that was tight. I would have had fun doing something like that. But you know, it's next year and there's other venues and other events and shit. Let's shout out Duno. I did see Duno there partying on some shit. <clears throat> Yeah, Yeet. Yeet is like, uh, man, I don't know. That's just like one of them. Fee, 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 whatever the fuck they saying. And with him on the stage yelling in the mic and all that, that shit just, that shit just tight, man. Yeah. I had to call a motherfucker a bad motherfucker, but he's a bad motherfucker. Smash that like button for sure, for sure. Smash that like button. <clears throat> Do no making moves and he the youngest in the crew. For sure, for sure he is. I ain't mad at him. I'm not mad at that nigga. He doing stand up. Get it in. Get it in. Two five one three three four Bama. Shout out said from the view. I see you. Tiny, you gotta get a Discord. Yeah, I do want to get a Discord, but the Discord, the Discord and, and Reddit is like cousins. They like cousins. The Discord and Reddit is like cousins. Like they it's like its own thing that could either help you or hurt you, depending on what's going on. So I don't know. I ain't in the, I do want a discord though. Cause I, I feel, I, I feel like it's easier and it's better to do this talking to somebody or if somebody was like me just talking to the screen by myself right here, it is like a, it ain't hard, but it is, it's something you got to get used to doing. If that makes sense, especially doing it for fucking however long I'll be doing it for. I mean, I'm for sure definitely getting used to it and better at it, but I prefer. That's why I don't, I don't be tripping if bees want to pull up or something. Pull up, okay? I'll be needing somebody to talk to. I mean, I'll be talking to y'all in the chat. Shout out to y'all in the chat. Y'all help me get through this because if I had no chat, trying to do this with no chat, I think I'd cry. With no chat, I'd be talking. I'd be going from here to there to there to there to there. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Discord and, and uh, uh, Discord and Reddit, they like cousins. Like they they fuck around and sabotage your whole little get down. Yeah, negativity. Yeah. We're in the chat tonight, everybody, for sure. How many people I need to get to 6K, though? That's what I need to know. That's what I need to know. It's my Friday. I'm happy. Y'all understand? I'm in a good place right now. I'm in a good place right now. I'm just... I don't know. I just feel good. Probably come here with, at the congregation with my good people. Beating the case. Yeah. Tiny is Hollywood Brown, a good pick for the Chiefs. Oh, yeah, I'm glad you asked that. Yeah, for sure. Hollywood Brown, he he, just, he a gadget player. You got to scheme him open. I mean, he could get open because he, he's he's fast and he's he cool. But if you can scheme him open, like he going to be a better Hartman. He ain't going to be Tyreek Hill, but he a Hartman. I say he better than Hartman. Yeah. You have five. That's still 30. 
five point. That's still 30 people. Mad Hustle, what up? Go subscribe. Go arrest somebody, Tiny. Now I'm chilling right now. I got I'm chilling with the people. I'm chilling. I will go arrest somebody. I can't arrest nobody. I ain't got no handcuffs. I can only put somebody under citizen's arrest, just like you. You can put somebody under citizen's arrest. That's crazy getting put under citizen's arrest. What type of shit is that? Like, how do that work? Like, you're a serious. Yeah, what is it? How do a citizen's arrest work? Have you uh have you spoke on the DAC allegations? Yeah, I spoke on them last episode. Basically, I feel like uh, you know, shit, it's it's about to be contract time. So they gotta throw some shit on his name, or you know, to make it look like you you ain't about to get all the shit you think you want. You ain't been winning. You ain't been winning. And well, now we about to bring this old little shit up on you. You thought you you uh it was swept under the rug in 2017. But nah, nigga, we're just waiting for this time because we knew this time was going to go. Yeah, so yeah, I feel like it's more... I feel like I got to do with his contract more than anything. If he wasn't under for a contract or if he wasn't asking for all, all that chili, I don't think that was that would happen to that nigga. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, that is that is damn near kidnapping if you if you uh if you innocent. Cause like what you just do, you just say, "Hey, I'm placing you under citizen's arrest." Like what the fuck is that? Who? That's what I'm saying. We got a bunch of bullshit ass laws and bullshit ass. Uh, like who even thought of that? Citizen's arrest. For sure, for sure. Vikings gonna trade both of their one pick Arizona so for the pen. Get Jesse McCarthy and then more rehearsal. Hell nah. Vikings, I don't think they need a receiver. Y'all just y'all got fucking y'all got uh Justin Jefferson and y'all got SC. What is his name? Jordan uh Addison? I got y'all got SC. Y'all don't need no receiver. That's what you're not doing. Yeah. That's crazy. A citizen arrest. I wonder how that happened. How that I want to know who went to jail for a citizen arrest. Like, how is that? What's the process for a citizen's arrest? Do I gotta is citizen's arrest when you just call the police? Is that technically a citizen's arrest? Or is pressing charges a citizen's arrest? Or a citizen's arrest a whole its own little thing. Like what I need to somebody, damn, I wish I had the internet. This is why I wish I'm gonna get better and we gonna do we gonna elevate y'all. Don't worry about nothing. I just I gotta get this iPad and get this iPad turned on through ATT. And then I'm gonna be able to use my iPad like a phone. And I'm gonna be able to look up shit like this. A uh when tiny I'm Muslim. And tune in before fast. That's right. Shout out to you, Elijah. Before fast. That's tight. You fasting all day. So are you gonna eat right quick in the morning, real quick before you fast? Like you gonna try to get it in, or you just like fuck it? I'm about to thug it out. I appreciate you, Elijah. Make sure you go subscribe if you're not subscribed. They restrain they ass to the uh, police gun. You restrain them. Oh, you restrain them. And then you call the police? So when you call the police, you're like, hey, I want to put this person under citizen's arrest. Come meet me at blah, 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 blah. And then, yeah. Yeah, citizen's arrest don't sound, I don't even, I want to know how often is citizen's arrest used. I want to know what is citizen's arrest. Like, what's the criteria, and how do you do citizen's arrest, and how often is citizen's arrest used? We need to just get rid of that shit. Our, that's what I'm saying, Tony for president. Anything that we ain't using that's just there for bullshit, let's get that shit out the paint. Like, get, let's get citizen's arrest out the paint. We don't need that shit. For real.
Ain't no thinking shit out. You better eat. Nah, for real. Eat the chicken. Salami, eggs, and bacon. Prayers for Lupe. He just had a heart attack. What? Oh, prayers for Lupe. She just had a heart attack. I just read Lupe Fiasco. I thought she had a stroke. Prayers for her, though. For sure, prayers for her. Yeah, no, I think I think she did have a stroke or something. I did hear something about her having a stroke. I don't know if she had a heart attack after she had the stroke. God damn. But yeah, prayers to her and her and her health. For sure, for sure. Uh certain situations a private person can make an arrest. Oh no, certain situations a private person. Person can make an arrest without a warrant. Jesus. Oh yeah. Okay, you was talking about the time uh, the charger. That's all I was about to say. I thought you was a Charger fan, kid. Okay? When you threw me off when you said Vikings, but I read that wrong. My bad. I'm hot. Blame the truth. Okay, certain situations a private person can make an arrest without a warrant. What the? F That's what I'm saying. Let, let's, cause it looked like you copied and pasted that. So certain situations a private person. What the fuck is a private person? A private person. That's all. I'm already. I'm already fucked up from certain situations. I'm cool with that. But then after that sentence, it says certain situations a private person. Now I'm lost. What the fuck is a private person? A private person can make an arrest without a warrant, okay? These citizens' arrests occur when ordinary people either detain criminals or direct police officers to detain uh, a criminal. Okay. I, I kind of... I'm kind of a little. I'm. I'm. I ain't lost, but I. I get what they're trying to say. Mm. Kyrie hit a buzzer beater. Nah, I didn't see that. I didn't see that. I was watching Rolling Loud. I didn't see the buzzer beater. I didn't see the buzzer beater. Shout out Kyrie though. If y'all not subscribed, please go subscribe. We on the road to 6K. I think I need 30 more subscribers. I know everybody in here not subscribed. We need 30 more. Tiny gonna use a sentence to rest on the motherfucker. No, I'm not. Top of the Lily K Mo One. Where you from, K Mo One? Show me where you from. Why you why you keep uh timing out TC? Jared, he just asked a regular question. What's going on? He just asked, should Bronny stay another year or what you call it? Why you keep timing him out? What's what's up with you, Jared? Flash that like button, make sure your mama subscribe. Getting the 6K. Yeah, yeah, we getting the 6K. For sure, for sure. But why you why you kicking that nigga? Uh oh. Y'all can hear me? Y'all can hear me now? Damn. This shit. Whenever I do something with this phone, that shit mute, mute. I can't 
can't hear. It's still no sound. It gotta be sound now. All right, now it's a herd. All right, it's a herd. Kmo, where you said you was from? I seen Jamaica in the building. Blaze one for the nation. Smoking his Rochon for the Jamaicans. Smoking his Rochon. I need 30 more subscribers here. Thoughts on Kanye and Boosie internet beef. Uh, I ain't see. I ain't updated on Kanye and Boosie internet beef. Yeah, I ain't updated on Kanye. I I'm think I am kind of a little updated. I think I am. I think I am a little updated, but I feel like Kanye. He more so. Uh, shit. He don't like. He don't like people like Boosie. Put it like that. He don't like people like Bo Boosie. Not on duty. Yeah, not on duty. Oh, nine wheels. Not on duty. Yeah, what was his last response? I didn't see it. I, I do remember him on, like, Drink Champs mentioning Boosie name or some shit like that. Uh, yeah, I, I believe that. Boosie, a different type of breed. I don't think Kanye... Is Kanye and Boosie even on the song? Do we even got a song with Kanye and Boosie on there together? No, we don't. Mm. Boosie, Kanye, Boosie. I'm going Kanye over Boosie, though. Uh, just the type, I mean, I, I fuck with Boosie, but I like Kanye. Kanye, one of my favorite rappers, is is Q, Kanye, uh, 50 Cent. Well, Q, 50 Cent, Kanye, Kanye third. I, I put 50 over Kanye. But yeah, they're my, they're my three uh, favorite rappers. You might be on Dream Champs this week. Yeah, I heard. I heard. Shout out to QWAP doing this thing, man. Why y'all on B's? B's ain't even in the chat. And I hear y'all. I see y'all all on B's. Why y'all on B's? How are you not sleepy? I'm not sleepy because I'm here with the chat. I'm here with the people. <clears throat> That's how I'm not sleepy. <clears throat> 